Yo, what the heck is going on, everybody? It's your guy, Snowbike Mike, back at it once again for another kind of funny games afternoon streaming. Gosh darn it. I missed you all, but I'm happy to be back on a Friday because guess what? We're already looking forward to the weekend. It's the end of the week. You made it through another work week. You made it through another school week. And guess what? Now it's time to have some fun with your friends. And hopefully myself and my dude, CEO Junior, Mr. Sad Boy, my guy Barrett on the ones and twos is going to be playing some games with me. And we're going to hopefully bring a smile to your day before you kick off the weekend. So we hope you're excited. Hope you're ready to rock. Barrett, I'm looking at you. How are you, big dog? Doing well. You know, uh, let's see. What have, what have I been up to? I, uh... I rolled credits on Horizon Forbidden West last, uh, yeah, I yesterday. It. I saw the tweet. Tell me about it. Tell me about it. Get me in it. Uh, on a kind of funny scale, I would give it a okay. three out of five. And it's wow. funny because we okay. were, okay. you know, we were talking about, like, the three out of five is, it's an okay, right? Um, and it's fun, like, we were talking about it with Andy where it's like, okay could mean many things. It's like, it's okay. Mm -hmm. Or mm -hmm. it's like, mm -hmm. it's okay. And I feel... Both of those things at the same time mm. for Horizon, mm. you know, uh, there there are a lot of great moments, um, a lot of things this time around that got me way more interested in like the world and the the lore and the story and stuff like that. Mm -hmm. um, I just I butt heads with the gameplay so much, and I, I I think it's a little bit both of a a me thing, and I do genuinely think a little bit of a, a, a game thing. Um, okay, so okay. I, I I thought it was you know very okay. I honestly like. You know, I think there's a lot of open world trappings that I think a lot of people would criticize uh, Assassin's Creed for, but mm. don't criticize this game for, which I find uh, I find interesting. I don't know if that's just because it's it's got like the PlayStation presentation behind it, right? I don't I don't know. Um, it's yeah, it's interesting, but that's just me. Um, and you what? know, I, I going into it, I knew like I'd had a frustrated relationship with the the first Horizon. Um, but yeah, I think it's, it's an okay game. It's okay. okay game. I, I mean, I like having an okay game. You know yeah. what I mean? It's just fine. We're having a busy first two months of the new year. As you know, Bear, there's a lot of games out there to jump into. Okay. It's fine. If you're digging it, you play through it. If you're not, you move on to the next one. But I like that you got through that and you played it all. Of course, you and I now are jumping into the old school God of War game. Oh. So we get to go back I mean, in time. Here's the thing once though again. too, Mikey, like I got Elden Ring right here. And yo, I was able to play Elden Ring, Bear. five don't minutes of Elden me. Ring before I realized, oh fuck, I got to like, uh, we got like a morning meeting today. So, um, I, yeah. I have played 10 hours of Elden Ring, Bear. And I'm going to talk yeah. about it on the X-Cast, but I've played 10 hours of Elden Ring exclusively co-op. I have not played a single minute by myself. I've played it all co-op. And I will tell you, the game, now, you know, don't get at me in the comments or get up tight, chat. The game is not built for co-op, okay? Because you go into these mini boss fights, not the big baddies. Right. Those guys will whoop your butt still in co-op. But you're going to go into these mini dungeon fights that you probably saw with Blessing and Andy. And the boss is just not built for more than one person to be on there. Because what happens is, is I backstab him. He stands up. He looks at me. Andy backstabs him. He falls mm. down. He stands up. I backstab him. A lot, a lot of the, like simple, a lot of simple oh, cheesing yeah. and stuff. Interesting. The whole game is just not built for that. It's a ton of fun to be with people, but uh, yeah, it's just not built for co-op. But I'm loving it. I'm having a ton of fun, and it's really, really special. It's a great game. So yeah, Bear. If you, I mean, Bear, you say the word. You turn that thing. I off. mean, we get lost, here's bro. here's the deal. Here's <laughs> the deal. Maybe you know we play some God of War. If we fill up okay. that bar. Okay, and we okay. go for the extra hour before the first yep. two hours are up. Maybe we, go to we Elden play, Ring. Maybe we play we some Elden, Elden, Ring. Elden Ring. Yeah. Okay. I like that. Hey, Twitch chat, let's get you involved because along with Barrett beating through Horizon, getting ready for God of War, getting excited about Elden Ring, of course, I want to check in with all of you. I've missed you for the past two days. I want to know how you all are doing. What's your weekend plan? So get them up in the chat. Are you playing Horizon Forbidden West chat, right now? Chat is trying to tell Elden you, Ring? Mikey. Have you heard what the news about Hank the Tank? Not being one bear, but three but different three fucking bears. bears. <laughs> I heard that, bro. I heard that. I don't know what's up with that bear. Can we do some investigating into that? I don't know if we can get a link somebody. But yeah, I, I, I have seen some tweets come my way that's saying, hey, it looks like Hank the Tank could possibly be three bears, which is incredible. Uh, we will have to check that out. But I will say, I did shred the gnar the past two days with my buddy J.D. Neal. It's been very, very great to get back up on the slopes. And 
you know, I didn't get to talk about it, Bear, and I want to, you know, now what, this what, is our Was time. it me playing the skiing game last week oh. on last week's stream that got you into the mood? As, <laughs> I was going as fast as you were in that skiing game, actually. Um, but I want to talk about two things. So let's talk about the fun things. Then I want to talk about something special to me because I didn't get to do it on the Kind of Funny podcast. And you, as, as everybody knows that's watching right now, like this is my time on the streams to do whatever and hang out with, you know, my incredible crew of Kind of Funny members. But I want to talk about the fun stuff first. So Barrett, oh my gosh, nothing is better than going back and reigniting the flame of one of your old passions, right? You think back to yourself, maybe you like skateboarding, maybe you like running, maybe you like hiking, maybe you have these things in your life where like, man, I loved doing that back in the day, but I kind of grew out of it. Maybe it was a safety and health concern. Maybe I moved and I just don't do that anymore. And for me, over my 13 years here up in Tahoe, I went from 120 days on the slope to 110 75 then over to 80 right and then it just started slowly dwindling down as i got you know older and i changed up different things that i was passionate about right and so these past couple of years i haven't snow biked like i used to but going out there with jd was truly a blast it was really something special just to shred the gnar get steezy uh i was impressed with how much my outfit came together barrett that was a big deal for me was What's the did outfit? You, did right? you get any good pictures of the outfit? Can we, I did can get we a really good picture. If you, if you go on to uh, my Twitter, you will see the fit. Uh, the fit is up. So please go check that out, y'all. Go check that out. Let me know what you think of the hot fit. But uh, I really, really enjoyed being out there. I liked going fast. I like shredding. I loved doing the stanky leg. I tried to get up and do the embrace the sun, blow some kisses at some people. But uh, all around, just a good time, you know, bonking, ripping up some corduroy, fun time. But what I want to get to as well, Baird, is, as you know, B, uh, in 2020, we all kind of changed our lives due to the pandemic, right? A lot of us lost our jobs. Some of us never went back. Like me, I never got to go back to my job. I actually, you know, was let go and then never really went back. And those people were my friends and family from 18 years old all the way up to 31 years old, right? Like there was people there that had been with me for years of my young adult life and I never got to say goodbye, I never got the proper send off. And this was the first time in the two years since the pandemic where I actually got to go up and see the place that I worked at, see those familiar faces. Hell yeah. And it was really impactful. And that's the word of the day I want everybody to remember is impact. Leaving an impact on somebody's life and appreciating the impact that others leave upon your life. Because when I looked around, it was really, really special to see some of the employees and them come up to me with big smiles and like so happy to see me and them saying, oh, I miss you, Mike. It's not the same without you. And the impact I left on a lot of these people's lives. And it was something when you're young, Barrett, I don't think you, I didn't grasp it, right? Of like, I got a high manager role at a large corporation at a young age. And so you get thrown with different things, right? You get this corporate side who's like, yo, do this, do that, follow the guidelines. Yeah, a lot gets thrown, the human at, thrown, side. thrown at you, especially yeah. for being so young. Like, that's, a, that's mm -hmm. a lot to take on. And then there's the human side of it. And I think I give a lot of credit to this guy, Bob, who was my boss and other co-manager at the time, where he's like, Mike, it's about the people, right? It's about the people and taking care of them and ensuring that they're having a good time at work they're taking care of because they'll give you their best, right? And you're in this weird state at 22 years old of like, what do I do with this juggling match? Do I appease these people who pay me and tell me what to do? Do I appease the people who are here doing the job that I don't want to do, but I need them to do, right? And I always fell in line with Bob of like, take care of these people because they're going to do all of that. And there's the ones next to you shoulder and shoulder doing this job, right? And so to see that impact I left on people's lives was really, really special. And then it got me thinking, Man, these people were with me and they left an impact on my life. It got me kind of teary-eyed thinking about, oh man, all the memories, all the moments, them knowing about me. The best was Steve Rowe. This older gentleman started laughing. I told him I'm going to move to San Francisco and he started giggling because he knows I'm bad with my money, which then leads me to this. Oh, God. God. God damn it, Mike. <laughs> I, I, lo I love you go on this, like, very emotional tirade, seeing people that you haven't seen in a while, yeah, yeah, going yeah. into, like, what that meant for you, like, in the coming of age as an adult, responsibility, interpersonal relationships, and yeah. leads into just, I've wasted more money. <laughs> I've wasted more money. So here's the deal. Uh, Baron, I want to give a big shout out to everyone around the globe, no matter who you are. 
there are so many creative people out there. I'm thinking about you, Nerf Alice. I'm thinking about a lot of other people. They're so creative and like do incredible things and like sell these awesome things to people on Etsy or on eBay and anywhere, right? And so I've always got jealous and I've always wanted something Baird. Like I think of Corey Cudney working on Halo Infinite and he has the cool like game disc and like the big ship date, right? Like those kind of plaques and panels. And I've always wanted one myself. And so I went on to Etsy and I was like, I want a framed couple of video games that are so special to me, right? And so as you can see, big shout out to Random IQ is the name on Etsy. They have these really cool framed game discs with the background of the cover art. And so I went wild and I bought a couple of my favorite games of all time out here. I have, of course, Halo 2, my favorite from my childhood. Then after that... Grand Theft Auto San Andreas. I love that. And then one more. Grand Theft Auto Vice City Barrett. Now, these are really special because I love them. I think they're really cool with the look of the game disc in the background. So I want to give a big shout out to all those incredible creative people around the globe that allow me to live out my dreams of my, you know, aesthetic and the things I want in my life because you all are so talented and I know I could never do that. But Barrett, one more thing is he had Metal Gear Solid oh. one game discs. Oh, and shit. it comes as a four pack. They're not as cool as I wanted to. Like, you know, on the Grand Theft Auto, right? You have the hot chick, you have the cool logo. Halo 2 has Master Chief on it, right? right? But like the Metal Gear Solid ones, they just weren't as like cool looking or stand out as I want. Mm, but they definitely- like the discs themselves. Yeah, the discs themselves. But they have the awesome like special memories that you and I created that I'll never forget, right? And so it was one of those where I looked at it and I was like, man, do I get those? And so I decided not to, but I definitely am gonna buy more. <laughs> you thought about it, so you, you thought know, about it. I'm gonna buy more. And that's my story, because I missed you all for the whole week and I wanted to catch up with all the special stuff and make sure you all appreciate the day, get ready for your weekend, and so we all can catch up. So I wanna give a big shout out to the Mav show in the building. Hello, Mav. It's great to see you, I hope you're doing well. Thank you for rocking with us, super, Fuzz is in the building. Toby Blue, uh, I hope you all are ready to rock and roll and have some great times. Barrett, we're playing God of War, the original. It's yeah. you and I on a journey. I'm so excited to play. Yeah, let's get into it. I forget where we left off last time. Uh, and I know uh, some people are asking, why are they playing God of War? Well, you know, uh, we played uh, through Metal Gear Solid the yes, one did. through yes, four last did. year, and it was such a fun time. We were thinking about maybe doing a different series because I was personally a little burnt out on uh, Metal Gear after streaming it six months straight. Mm -hmm, um, mm -hmm. And looking for something a little more simple, a little more fun, um, and especially with the you know the anticipation of Ragnarok still possibly coming this year, a lot of people are doubtful. I'm still very much hopeful, um, mm -hmm. and so yeah, I thought it would be fun to start off with God of War. Will we do all of the games? I'm uncertain uh, because all of the games are available on PS Now. But do we want to get into the nitty gritty of like Chains of Olympus and like all that stuff, or do we just want to do one mm -hmm. through uh, one through three and then 2018 and all that stuff? We'll have to. We're gonna. We're going to ebb and flow. We're going to ebb and flow. Mm -hmm. And of course, today, because it is Elden Ring launch day, uh, we're going to you know, we're gonna play for a couple hours. And hey, if you uh, if you fill the bar completely before uh, the, the first two hours are over, we'll switch over to Elden Ring. And I'll play yeah. some Elden yeah. Ring for mm -hmm. the very first mm -hmm. time. Because I, I literally... Mike, this morning, I made my character. I, I went to the first uh, fight interaction, which is a scripted death. And then I got mm -hmm. to, like, the first little, like... A uh, little point where you can like sit down. It's like the it's like their version of like the um, uh, the bonfire in Elden hmm. Ring. Okay, I yeah. got uh -huh. to that, and then I was like, "Oh, we got our morning meeting," and that's all I played. So it would really uh, it, it it would really be the beginning of the game, which I know we've uh, we've played through on other content before. Um, mm -hmm. So I don't know if it's as interesting, but if you want to hang out with some Elden Ring, fill up that bar, everybody. Fill up that, fill up bar. that bar. We'll play Elden Ring, and if you're on the fence on Elden Ring. You know, buy it, play it with your friends co-op, just destroy the game together like I'm doing right now. And you'll have a ton of fun laughing and giggling as you dominate these bosses. All right. But for now, let's uh, jump into PlayStation now. Hopefully this is going to get a, a spruce up uh, soon as well uh, with like all of the murmurs of uh, Project yeah, Spartacus yeah, ramping really... up. They talked mm -hmm, about it on Games mm -hmm. Daily today. Yeah, I, I want to get the chat involved too, Bear, because of course you and I will have the kind of funny X-Cast later this afternoon. We'll... 
we'll bring up a little bit of that comparing you know apples to oranges there and talking about what we'd like to see because i know what i would like to see out of playstation subscription service so i am interested to see what the xbox side of things would like to see out of that because you know we all play games we're playing them everywhere me gary paris and yourself so i would look forward to the playstation spartacus but we're going to talk about xbox game pass and a possible family plan what would you like to see out of the family plan is going to be the topic of the week and this is a tough one for me barrett because as you know i like spending my money in wasteful ways i don't share my accounts with anyone right and i am a single dude by himself right i don't have anybody in the house and so a family plan to me it just doesn't make sense right i don't think about that i don't do that so i need your help twitch chat what would you really want to see out of a family plan and also like you know, what What are the things that you need from a family plan as well? Let me know. Uh, of course, chat. I always try to rely on you on audio balancing, so let me know how it all sounds. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Again, audio quality for the PS3 game isn't going to be great because we're streaming it, and also that's just kind of like PS3 audio quality. Uh, mm -hmm, we've been spoiled mm -hmm. by the PS4 and PS5 of how good audio sounds. So good. So um, good. Uh, Toby Blue says a tad loud the game. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. All right. Um, we're gonna load. Hopefully, it still has my saves. Okay, cool. <clears throat> now I forget where we left off. So, all right. This seems to be where we left off. So we are making our way downtown. through Athens. Yeah, we should be downtown Athens, I believe. And I believe we are just fighting the big dude, who I think, was, or we're like next to the big dude, who was Hades, correct? Ares. Ares. Ares, Ares, Ares is the god of war. He had like we we fought a bunch of enemies and he was just like casually walking through um mm -hmm. Athens in the background, which was like really yeah, cool. Yeah. Uh of like we're we're fighting this and he doesn't even know we exist. He's just like walking past this, like, yeah, like you're not my uh mm -hmm. you're not my fucking main priority here, little Kratos. Oh god, I gotta get used to the controls again. This is what happens when, you know, you you play an old PS3 game and then don't play it for a week and a half, and in between that you play a modern PS5 game. A lot game. of other games, yeah, yeah, yeah. So, so this is my heavy, this is my jump, this is my roll. All right. <clears throat> yeah, that's it. So here's a good one right here. And that This is the thing that I juggle with, Bear, because you know I'm a dude that likes to follow the rules, right? I'm a plain Jane, follow the rule, don't break oh, the God. law type of jabroni. And right now on the family class, we have Sir Harat, which I'm mispronouncing, I'm sure, says the family plan isn't always your mom and poppy or your bro and sis. It could be your closest friends and yourself enjoying games together. Now, Barrett, that was always one thing, like, that's why I never share all my accounts with anyone and stuff like that, because I didn't know. I, I always took it as you're not supposed to do that, right? And I know none of the people have do, do do that, and I'm not mad at that, right? But, like... Are we okay with doing that? Do you think Microsoft is okay with you doing that, I should say? I know we, as a collective of people trying to save money and doing that, are cool with that. But, like, are we... Are, do you think they're all right with you doing that? Because I thought, thought they wrote, like, Netflix was trying to IP, like, check and ban people for doing stuff like yeah. that, right? Yeah, I don't, I'm not too sure. But that'll be an interesting one to, to see how they try to... If they do Police something like that, that. yeah. Yeah. Yeah, because I don't even know how Netflix would be able to really... I mean, I guess Hulu does it, but they only can do it if you've got, like, Hulu Live or you watch live TV. Where, mm -hmm. like, you can't... If you're not in the same uh, zip code as where, like, ever the main uh, account holder is, like, you can't okay, use okay. the Hulu account. So I wonder if they're going to mm. try something like that. Yeah, it's weird. Okay, interesting. Let's push it up. There we go. There we go. Uh, that wood felt a little tough. I feel like I should have broken that wood in like a like a hit or two. Nah, you had that. You got that. Oh, that's cool though. It, like it be, like how I get immediately killed if I get frozen by a Medusa head in midair. Mm, These little they, bad they guys. Do, that's yeah. sweet. Yeah, yeah. God, this a lot of cool stuff in this fucking 2005. Uh, uh, I'll give it to game. them. I'll give it to them. Yeah. Didn't think they had it in it, but yeah. they got it. Oh god. Scarver, yeah. happy Friday to you, my friend. How are you? There we go. 
Yeah, I forget exactly like what our objective is right at this moment. If we're if we're still just like in the we're going after Ares, or if there is something more specific. So let us know. I think yeah. it's we're going after Ares because he's invading Athens, which has Athena in there, and I think he's coming after Athena, but he's not allowed to attack Athena, but he well, can attack Athens. Yeah, things. well, like that was the I whole thing. He, he's trying to mess with Athena, I think. Oh okay, God, was this? Get me. They won't get across. These monsters, they'll, they'll tear me apart. They're gonna tear you apart anyway. Alright, well, we can't go that way. Uh, yeah, so Ares is attacking Athens. She can't retaliate because gods aren't allowed to fight each other. But then it's like that weird thing where it's like, isn't Ares going after her city kind of like an act of war, you know? Um, so that's why she's sending us. And then, because we're technically, oh, like, we're not a god, but we work for the gods, so we're, we're, like, essentially, I think, like, a hired, like, a hired gun, you know, for the gods. So we're trying to help out Athena. So, yeah, I think that's where we're We're here at. to help, okay? Fatal's here to help. That's what they say about it. Right, we're going time. in circles now. Oh, so, okay, Yeah, this okay. is where we were Well, that earlier. jabroni won't lower the bridge. Yeah. You gotta tell that jabroni Ooh. to help you out. Oh. Yeah, we gotta we gotta figure out another Oh, way. My, oh my god. god. Yeah, a little, si a little side jump right now. How do I... There we go. People are shooting bows at, or arrows at me. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. I forgot how to, like, swing the rope. <laughs> oh, that, hey, you still did it. Oh, okay, just a oh god. nice little okay. chest area. Okay, buddy. Oh, and that's... that's All right, buddies. Oh, that's cool. Do you have a ranged attack that you can do on those guys? I forget. You got a bow and arrow? I don't think you're going to be able to do that, yeah. Can you freeze them? Maybe? Ah, they seem too far away for that, though. Yeah, no. Hold on. Let's see. Let's see. What else do I have? See what you got. There's got to be something. Blaze of uh, Chaos, besides, yeah, Poseidon's no. Rage, but that's like kind of like an area of effect kind of thing. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, and then mm -hmm. Medusa's Gaze. Like, yeah, that's all I got. How far does the gaze go? Not far enough? It's like no, close. I don't think so. I don't think so. I just want some health. Well, this is a no-go situation here. Because they're firing on all different patterns, too. You're yeah. just not getting the chance. Can I, like, jump over? I don't think I can. Oh, you're yeah, wild, no, I bro. Died. I mean, I you got to send it. You got to try it. You got to try it. Thank you to Johnny T80 for the tier one sub for nine months. Thanks, Johnny, for the support. Don't forget today, we're filling up that bar, working towards our monthly goals. Right now, the next big monthly goal, if we hit 10 monthly goals, I'm going to play Zelda Breath of the Wild with all of you for the first time ever. We'll play through this awesome game. We'll find out what's dope, what's not dope about the game and the franchise, because I have never played a Zelda game, and we could share this experience together after all of our streams. will be a nice little afternoon hang out on Monday and Tuesdays after all of our content. So if you like that, we can make that happen by filling up that bar, going for the extra hour, and playing some Elden Ring. Um, oh, he says, does the perfectly timed block reflect Yeah, I forgot that, I forgot that we can, uh, we can block. Nice job, Squid. Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. Um, alrighty. Alright. Journey, thank you for the Prime Gaming stuff for eight months. Friday edition, you're here on a Friday. You're looking towards the weekend. The what end all says no, do? it doesn't, which is interesting. Oh, yeah. that's tough. Yeah. What are you going to do this weekend, Bear? What you got? What you got, B? What kind of cool stuff you got? Play Elden Ring. Play Elden Ring is fire. Um. Oh, got a friend's birthday to celebrate. Uh, Love that. Jonathan Love that. Bornbush's birthday is this weekend. No so way, yeah, bro. Heck him. yeah, man. Oh, that's awesome. Um, so everybody this this Sunday, tweet at JM Dornbush. Happy birthday. Okay, tweet at him. Let um, him know. I'm trying to think of, of what else. Yeah, not much else. Elden Ring and hanging out with Dorno. That sounds like a great weekend to me. Great weekend right there, y'all. Oh, God. Uh, they already started shooting me, like, over here. We're going to go over this here again. Thank what, you for your comment. I like that. I, uh, 
Yeah, I'm excited because I'm going to take JD to the airport tomorrow, which means I get in and out. I love in and out in Reno, you know what I mean? So I'm going to get a nice little in and out burger, maybe twice, maybe once in Reno, once in Carson. I don't know. You know what I mean? I'm going to treat myself. Uh, and then I'm going to come back. I have Elden Ring and I also have Destiny, the Ooh. Witch Queen on the docket. I'm going to keep going. Hopefully I can keep Greggy semi interested in it. Yeah, have that go. I'm going to definitely going to go. Uh, we had fun. We played it together. We enjoyed the time for about two hours. We probably did about two to three missions on the campaign itself, but I was impressed. It's always nice going back to Destiny. It's a top tier first person shooter game, but um, I don't know, you know, as opposed to Greggy with the baby, the loving wife, the life, you know what I mean? It's just like, I'm going gamer hours on it. You know what I mean? I'm in. So yes, I will need help. Twitch chat if people are looking around. I'll probably be playing, looking for people to get on there. Uh, people are saying there's a direction I haven't gone yet. So hmm. I'm interested in figuring out. Oh, <coughs> is it down oh. here? Is it oh. down here? Oh. So, oh, okay. A little hidden one, a little hidden one. I got a Gorgon eye. Did I, how do I? And get back up. Yeah, how do I get back up? Am I just stuck here? <laughs> oh. Oh, no. Ooh, there we oh, go. Okay, okay. All right, a little climbing Dang. action. You guys got a little I mantle wonder. on it. I didn't know that. There's like something down here, maybe? Nope. <laughs> okay, no, we, <laughs> nope, we learned a lesson there. Learned a, <laughs> learned a lesson there. Yeah, yeah. Oh, man. All right. So there's an there's a direction we haven't gone in yet. There's a direction we haven't gone. We're gonna find it together, y'all. We're gonna find it together, everyone. Cause this gives us the shortcut back here. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. And this is the crazy spot, right? On the side, oh. yeah. No. Well, we climbed up no. this way. And this is like where these two chests are. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, I'm gonna mm -hmm. go grab those really quick. Right, yeah, we got that Gorgon Eye or whatever the fuck it's called. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Okay, okay. I like they can break the the sides of the building. Yeah, that, that's an interesting one right there. Breaking oh. just the sides is right. Is there something down here? No. I okay, thought I dead. saw a ledge. <laughs> you're dead. You're dead. You're dead. <laughs> Damn, I'm going to die in this game as many times as I'll probably die in Elden Ring, you know? We'll figure this out. We're going to figure this out together. Nobody in the chat so far has said anything yet, so that's surprising. Nobody knows. Maybe they just don't remember. Yeah. Can you, like... Can you turn this man into a rock? Can you jump across the side? R2. What does that do? So that just talks to him. That, that, that does okay, the that's thing just where he's me. like, oh, God. Oh, my God. Oh, I thought you made it back. There was like this moment. I, I was like, oh, I guess I thought he there. hit the ledge. <laughs> okay. Oh, I think I see it. Hold on. Okay, he thinks he sees it, y'all. No, never mind. I thought this was a higher <laughs> thing to jump on. Um, uh, Ninja Gaiden, thank you for the Prime Gaming sub for 10 months. What up, Ninja Gaiden? How are you, homie? It was 17 years ago. That was really 17 years ago? Wow. What? What a time. Uh, the end all says, I don't exactly remember. Uh, no, no, uh, Huggy says, I definitely don't remember 17 years ago. Jeez. Yeah, wow. I was like, that can't be right. <laughs> 2005 wasn't 17 years ago, right? <laughs> and then I remember I'm 27. It's like, oh, nope, yep, that, that adds yeah, up. That makes, that makes sense, that makes sense. I'm saying there's an area right before that point that you missed. Right before which point? Was 
right down here. What the f oh shit. Oh god, uh -oh. I forget like all the cool like uh -oh. Uh -oh. I was getting used to all like the cool like combos and shit, you know? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I yeah, I I think I just backtracked. Hold on, wait a minute, y'all. Yeah, give me a hold on. So we got the Icarus wait Lift. Wait a minute, y'all. Wait a minute, y'all. Orion's Harpoon, what? Hades Reverse. Hmm. Oh, there we go. Oh! 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 That was sick. Oh my god, these fucking underground boys. Don't They're back fuck them up. This is just the area that we were at before. <clears throat> There's a pit you need to jump across. The pit. What the? Oh. Right over here. Oh, that was when you shot the doorways down, right? That was in a different area, I think. Though I don't That's even it? know what the fuck we just shot. They just shot off into the abyss. Yeah. I need health. And it keeps throwing me off because I think like red orbs are health, but they're not. Mm. In this game. No, it's no, chaos. no. What is the red orbs? Is that uh? It's my chaos. XP? Uh, yeah, XP shit. Okay. Oh, okay. uh, was just, I remember I wanted to upgrade something. I forget what it was. Oh, I think it was Medusa's gaze. Yeah. Hmm. <clears throat> God, just let me hit a. Just let me press a button to upgrade it. <laughs> I gotta hold it down for like 10 seconds. Jesus. Alright, we did it. Oh, I got it. Oh, God. Oh. Okay, okay. Uh oh. Oh, look at no, that. No, stop it. Oh, okay. Get out of there, Kratos. No, no, Get out do of there, Kratos. Don't do that. I forgot I can. I, got, I have the, like, the weird little parry. Oh, yeah, I'm about to die. This is, this is gonna be bad. This is gonna be bad for all of us. No, you got this. Survive. Oh! oh what was that cool jump? What, yeah, what was that? Oh, wow. I can't you do it again. What was that? Dude, good for you, man. Oh. Alright, I'm back in the zone. I'm back in the zone. Put me back in, coach. You know, give me some more health. That would be cool. Yeah, that's great. Oh my god, so, they just keep coming! No way, Creed. Have you really been doing that? You've been doing the character mod switches on seafood? That's awesome. Wait, what, what are some of the cool ones you've seen? I've seen so Daredevil. We showed, off, we showed off Shaggy on a morning <laughs> show. They put in Shaggy in the game. And it was awesome because they actually had Shaggy like fighting the first boss, which was really, really cool. That's fucking hilarious. He says playing as Iron Fist right now. That's funny. Okay, that's super cool. But like the Netflix version of Iron Fist, because that'd be hilarious. Where do you think those shows are gonna go, Bear? Because they're getting pulled off of Netflix soon. Do you, th do you right? think they'll make it to Disney Plus? Like, where where are those going? Do you I think. think who if anything, right? Oh, I mean, they, they've been really? putting okay. the, the X Men movies on Disney Plus, and those are usually okay. like, I don't know if any of them. Oh, there's, they said they're going to Hulu. They, the War Machine, them say they're going to oh, Hulu. Sure. Okay. Wow, yeah, interesting. Gotta, Pick up. 
<clears throat> yeah, I, I mean, yeah, it makes sense for, for Disney, especially, you know, with some of the, I don't want to say anything just in case people haven't seen it in theaters with No Way Home, right? Um, but there's some definitely developments in that movie where it's like, all right, maybe maybe Disney like wants to pick some of these back up, um, mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. and it seems like those those shows in particular I feel like are a little much for Let Disney Plus. Because um, I'm trying to like, is Logan on anywhere? Chat. I would I would imagine Logan's just on. Oh my god, they just keep fucking coming. Um, I imagine they're just on. Um, uh, I imagine Logan's just on Hulu, right? If anything, I w- I couldn't see it being on Disney. Plus. But now we got conflicting reports. Now people are saying they're definitely coming to Disney Plus. They already announced it. No, now now we got people saying Hulu is owned by Disney. To come to Disney, y'all need to pick a lane. Hulu or Disney Plus? Let me know. Well, so it, it's weird because I think a lot of people outside the country uh, who watch oh. us assume Disney Plus works uh, mm. th- the same way as it does in the U.S. Because mm. I think there's like Disney Plus outside of the country like has like another service special, that's integrated yeah. into Disney Plus, mm-hmm. which isn't the same way for in America. Um, I forget specifically what it was called. Star. They're saying Star. Yeah, Star. And so, Disney Plus America doesn't get Star. So I'd imagine, uh, yeah, like outside of the country, you'll get <clears throat> you'll get these shows on Disney Plus. Um, and then in America, you're gonna get these shows on Hulu. Right, what do I need most? I need health. Stars like our Hulu, it's built into Disney Plus. That's pretty cool. Yeah, I wish it was all integrated into the same thing. That'd be nice. I know you can technically pay for it all in like one thing, but I wish it was just like one app. You know? You know what I'm saying, chat? One app to rule them all. No, I saw Joey in the chat. Mm-hmm. Joey, I believe, was just on an episode of the kind of funny screencast. She was. She was. I don't know when that's going up, but make sure to check it out when it goes up. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I like that. I, uh, I, you know, I, I was sitting there on Netflix, and on Netflix, Barrett, the latest I've been watching is just nothing but Seinfeld. Tried a little bit of Space Force Season 2, and so I'm trying to get away from just the Seinfeld constant rewatches that I've been mm-hmm. doing. And so I clicked on the Kanye documentary. Okay, so an oh. hour and a half. There's currently two episodes out right now, and they're actually really, really good. Truly enjoyed both of these so far. Episode three will become the switch and the downfall of Kanye, which I look forward to seeing. But the first two, Baird, are actually truly amazing. I was like, wow, these things are really, really good. A lot of behind the scenes footage is all captured by like, one of his homies who just gave up everything to follow him around with a camera. And I'm telling you, this old footage of this guy, Kanye, whoa, it's incredible if you don't know, dude. Joey wow. in the chat says Tim watch. talks about it on Streamcast. So oh my God, out, I wish uh, I for Tim's thoughts. Wish I talked about it with Tim because it's so good. Shout out to Cootie. Yeah, Cootie, bro. Shout out to Cootie. <laughs> this is a yeah, puzzle I, bear. Go back to the ladder. It's really blown okay. away. Yeah, I, I, I want to check those out. Like, a, it's a must watch. Yeah. Um, I'm interested in all aspects of like his kind of rise and, and fall. Um, there's something else that I wanted to bring up. You push that crossbow down to the plate. Mm, what? Tell us about it. Tell us about it. What plate? Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. Can I push this thing? Oh, I can. Oh shit. Oh my god, it's the slowest moving. Yeah, we're gonna take a little walk, a little yeah. slow slow walk, bro. Just a little bit. Just a little mm-hmm. bit. Oh right, right. I can do this. <laughs> the good oh, old there you kick. Go. There you go. And speaking of things that we've been watching as well. <clears throat> the first um, 
episode in the entertainment arc for Demon Slayer. The dub finally went okay. up. Okay. Very okay. exciting. Very exciting. Very good. Mike, watch Demon Slayer. I'm telling you, man. Demon Slayer. Get the anime people excited, bro. Uh, Elements 93 with the Prime Gaming sub for 50 months. Yo, thank you so much for the 50 months of support. Thanks for using that Prime Gaming sub with us. Remember, you got Amazon Prime. You got Twitch Prime. You can link both those accounts together to make a Prime Gaming account. And get this, y'all. Throughout the month of, I believe, March, they're giving away seven free games just like before. So get... Take advantage of the free sub and the free games throughout the month that they're giving away, y'all. Nice. Um, all right. <clears throat> well, we want... Oh, oh! I get what we're doing here. I get what we're doing here. There you go, there you go. Dance with it, dance with it. <clears throat> Deadwood, thank you for the Prime Gaming stuff for 49 as well. Thanks, Deadwood. We're gonna, we're gonna climb up here, though. See what's up shoot here. the door open, Baron? Question mark. We're gonna find out together. Baron's gonna uh, solve this puzzle. Uh, yeah, I, I I figured out the the vibes here. He's got the vibe check. Vibe checks looking good. Um, so then we're gonna pull this lever again. Because if we kept it on, it would just reverse it back to where it was. Mm. So then we're gonna pull it here, and then that's gonna turn it to the direction we it, want it. Flip it. Flip it. Yep. 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 Fast Steady with the Prime Gaming sub as we well go. for 29 months. Thank you for using those Prime Gaming subs with us here at Kind of Funny. You're the best. No, no, I want to move it. Move it first, oh. and then we're, there we go. There we oh, go, Mikey. Oh. Look at this. Oh. There we okay, go. Okay. It's lined up. Everything's lining up. We didn't go through that door. No. It was locked. And did you get to watch any of the Dice Awards with Greg and Jessica Chobot? Uh, no, I did not. They did um, a great job. Another great year for them. Khalif and Alana showed up and got to present as well. They both nice. did a terrific job. Very, very good stuff. It was a, a fun show to watch. Fun, easy, quick show to watch. Did, everybody talks about ray tracing, but, you know, look at the reflection on the, the floor here. Look at this. They were doing Wait, this back in the PS2 days, this. and, they're, right. you know, people talk about ray tracing like it's a big fucking deal today. Mm -hmm. Dummies. I'm not going to open that quite yet, because we might need that later. Oh, shit. Here we Lord go. Lord Zeus. Oh. Kratos, Zeus! You grow stronger as your journey continues. But if you are to succeed in your quest... You will need my aid. I offer you the power of the greatest of all the gods, the father of Olympus. I offer you the power of Zeus. Take this weapon, Kratos. Take this power and use it to defeat your enemies. Whoa. Oh, okay, okay, maybe. Zeus is fury. All right. People. Yep, all let's right. go. Uh, I think it's funny that, like, it's Zeus's law, right? That, like, other gods aren't allowed to fight other gods. But, like, yeah, I'll help out this human take out, uh, maybe take out this god. Which is, like, okay, interesting. Okay. Like, Zeus, just, just let other gods fight other gods, you know? Um, hold on, give me just a second here. Give me a second, everybody. And we're going to check out this power that's somehow different from Poseidon's power, mm -hmm, which also mm -hmm, seems to be electricity-based. I'm really confused on, like, why does why Poseidon give us something that's lightning-based? He's a water man. <clears throat> Snake, you can't do that. You'll create a time paradise. Select, uh, right, and then press L2 to activate the attack. You have done well, Kratos. Go with the gods. Go forth in the name of Olympus. Well, we're gonna go forth. Figured I was gonna have to fight some dudes in this, uh, in this room. Oh, shit. Bolt action. Oh, yeah, here we go. Here we go. I don't want to use it yet. I don't want to, like, dwindle my, uh... Oh, what the f... What? What's going on? What's going on? Oh! Okay, okay. Alright. Can we go through this door now? No. Oh, maybe. Maybe. Give a little fire with it. Nope. Negative, <laughs> Never mind. Negative, negative. <laughs> 
Oh, but you know, you know what we're gonna do? You know what we're gonna do? We're gonna electrify that dude. There we go. We're gonna send a shock to his system. And it's gonna like, and then he's gonna pull the the lever. Mm, mm. Oh wait. Oh shit. Yeah, we can. Oh, there we go. Now we've got a fucking. Now we're this talking is here. This is your practice. There we go, go, Mikey. Now we've got a, a projectile. Now oh, now we can go that way. Now we can go that way. Camera angles. Right, give me some, uh, give me some magic here. Let me fill up my magic bar. Also, help us fill up the uh, today's bar. Get us closer to Mikey playing Breath of the Wild. Get us closer to. Oh, I really want to do that, man. I guess it's just not that. I think it's just a seven out of ten game. That's what people say. It's just a. It's you'll just never a be. Fine you'll game. never. I'll never you know, know. You'll never know. I'll never know who Zelda is and who Link is, you know what I mean? <laughs> I'll never know. Who's this Ganon character? I don't know. Ooh, we found another feather, though. Oh, and a Gorgonite. There's nothing really... Mitchell no Hop says, guess what? That's not gonna happen. Oh, Thank shit! Thank you, Mitchell Hop, for the 50 gifted subs on a Friday. God what damn. What up, Mitchell Hop? Thank you for the support. Thanks for making us smile. Thank you for... Filling up that bar with us, and just according with the five gifted subs. Hey, let's keep that energy going right now, and let's follow Mitchell Hop. Let's get this hype train going right now. Who's not subscribed? Because Mitchell Hop just lit a fire under my butt. Also, I'm gonna be honest with you, the I bar might be broken. Uh, no, it's catching up to all. Okay, that. okay, because it, it was like yeah, going yeah. up and then going down and then going up and then going down. No. Okay. When you're Mitchell Hop, you just crush the bar. You know what I mean? So if you're not subscribed, let me know. I'm gonna ride on the back of Mitchell Hop and just according, and we're gonna get this hype train not only going, but also moving, y'all. Let's keep it going right here, right now. As Mitchell Hop breaks the bar, it will try to figure itself out, don't worry. And let's keep this thing going right now, y'all. I think the bar's broken on my end. Uh, I'm watching it, I'm watching it. It's definitely- It's like, I don't know what to do anymore. Life. Mitchell Hop broke me. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you to Mitchell Hop right there. Thank you to Just According. And where are we? Oh, of course, Time Lords. I always like to make sure people are subscribed to this channel so you don't have to watch ads. You can get those awesome sub emotes and the dope badges that Andy Cortez got or made for us. So let's keep this going right now. Thank you to Mitchell Hop for the 50 gifted subs. Thanks again to Just According right there. And we'll keep going with the bar. Don't worry, I'll fix the bar. Whatever happens is right. Uh oh. Right now we there just enjoy Kratos. Going well, now, up and now I'm gonna go back things. to those chests because now I can get those chests because I can shoot the lightning at those dumb, those dumb arrow people. You know. No, I meant to dodge. There we go. There we go. I'm getting all this XP. Bear, they're they are called archers. No, they're called bow people, arrow people, whatever. Um, what else do I need? Uh, uh, yeah, let's get some magic back up in here. Let's get some health, and let's get some more XP. <laughs> arrow people in roof rooms. <laughs> <laughs> yep, 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 yep. Um, Mike, I don't know if you've listened to um, Planet of the Apes in review yet today, but oh, okay. Yeah, what do they debate, got? What do they there got? There's some debate about what what do you call an attic that's not really like an, an attic that's a bedroom, you know? A loft. A loft. All right, all right. I like that. That's I like what that. I would call that. That's a loft. There's some debate on whether we would call them roof rooms. On today's oh, roof side. rooms. Okay, okay. <laughs> I will say the loft bedroom is super, super dope. You know what I mean? Yeah. Like, if you got the loft up there, the loft is cool. But the downside of the loft usually no <laughs> door bear. It's an open, it's an open wall to usually the living room, right, or some sort of larger area in the house. 
So you don't get any sort of privacy mm. because you know you're kind of out there. So or the loft if is more of like yeah, nice like family you're, you're shut away because like usually the way to get in there you got to pull out the thing. You got to get, get a the ceiling. Oh. You got to get. Oh, yeah. now you're talking about the attic if you're going with a crazy ceiling. I like. Oh that yeah, one, yo, I like that. That's what we're saying. It's the it's the attic, but it's it's we don't use it as an attic. We uh we use it as like a bedroom. Mm. Oh. oh, that was a cool. That was a really cool move there. I got. Block, yeah, I got to remember to hot more. Sometimes it does. It does. Got to get a nice little fan up in there. But the loft yeah. bedrooms are super dope. Lofts are dope. Lofts are dope. Attics, on the other hand, attics are different. Yeah, finished attic. I like that one. Calamity Andrew plays. See, I like roof. Oh, I, I had a buddy with a crow's nest once at his house. The crow's nest is super dope. So what you would do is you'd walk up to their top level, and then they had a ladder where you'd climb up a ladder right to a small platform on the side of the house, and then you'd take a spiral staircase out of their house up by like essentially the chimney type vibe up to the crow's nest. It was very cool, oh, very cool, very cool stuff. Crow's nest, I'm gonna put one of those in my house one day. How do we feel about Murphy's beds? I don't know, BJ, but I'm not down with the Murphy's bed. Unless it was a tiny, unless you had like a studio room. I'm not down what with the What the fuck is a bed. Murphy's bed? That's the one that fold into the wall and you pull them down uh, and they come out of the wall. Yeah, I never, never been on one of those. Been on plenty of futons in my day though. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Mike, are you looking at the LA Thieves drop at noon? Let's take a look. I was not. I don't know if I saw it. Let's take a look. Is it on the Hunted Thieves website? What do they got? Let's 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 see if it's valid or salad there. Is it valid or is it salad today? Mm. Oh, the worst part is they won't let me take a look at the look. Oh you know, no. They locked on the website. It says you have two and a half minutes. Like, sir, I need to see if it's hot or not. You know what I mean? I need to know if I'm spending money. All right, Mike, I think we have to admit it. that the bar is broken. What the does, bar is hundred percent broken. What I does tried 50, to reset it. What does fifty equate to on the bar? So I was gonna give I was gonna give that about sixty percent of the bar. Okay. And I was gonna try what I tried to do is reset the bar to about forty percent health right there. After mm -hmm. Mitchell Hop, just according, and a number of other best friends supporting me. I put us at about sixty percent of the bar. So I don't know what's going on. I'm looking over at my side compared to your side and my side's back in zeros now. Yeah. Your side still has that little bit up. So I don't know if the widget is connecting from the website to the actual stream OBS system. You know what I mean? But um, we will keep an eye on that <clears throat> and we'll keep working on it right now. But we are more than 50% done. We're going to say we have 40% 40, 40 left. Hey! Yeah, I'm going to say... I'm gonna say 20 more gifted subs or whatever the equivalent is, then we'll play some Elden Ring for the extra. Oh! Also, who is this lady again? Was this Athena? We talked to her earlier because she, yeah, she had the nipples. Did we talk uh, to her? She had the she had the nipples thrown shown through her shirt. Oh yeah yeah. And yeah, I forget what she helped us with. Games. I for, uh, Mike, someone's also telling you to check <laughs> the bless you, uh, the Twitter to check out the fits. I'm checking the Twitter. I don't see you. I don't. Oh, you mean check out their Twitter? No. Oh, oh, I fell down here. Oh Thank shit! You. This is like all the way from forever ago. Remember we fought like all the like the big uh, the big beast boys over here? Yes, we did. God damn! I like how it's all like kind of connecting, like one cohesive map. I don't see it. Doesn't matter. It'll pop. It will pop up in two minutes, and I will tell you. Forty-three seconds, and it's gonna pop up. I'll tell you if it's hot or not. Uh, I'm probably not gonna buy anything, but we'll see. We'll see. But I did, Barrett. You would be very proud of me. So two big things happened over this weekend because you know I wanted to elevate my steez, right? Also, big shout out to Trent, Trent sixteen twenty one with the ten gifted subs. Thank you, Trent, for helping fill up that bar and keeping it going. Oh, there it goes. The there it goes. There we go. All right. There we go. Okay, so the bars awoken. The bar. Bar's trying to get back to life. The, the bar just needed a little bit juice to, to like wake itself back up, you know. But you know me, I, I like to buy a lot of clothes but never wear them because I have this crippling anxiety that I'm going to ruin them. And then my nice new clothes <laughs> I got, point? I can never wear. So now they just sit in the closet forever. And so I technically buy two pairs of everything so I can wear them without any sort of fear. So, two days. Here's the oh. deal, y'all. Two things happen. Two big things happen. I got to give uh, Luda her probiotic. Go, go do it. I'll tell the Twitch chat. Good chat. Two big things happened here. One. Oh, wait a sec, y'all. All right, everybody. We're going to hunterthieves.com. 
We're going to check out the 100 Thieves LA Thieves merch. So this is their Call of Duty team. I'm not vibing with the jacket, the lockup coach's jacket. I'm not vibing with that. The logo's all right. The L, the A, is, it's all right. It's all right. Uh, the hoodie, on the other hand, okay. White hoodies. I like the white hoodies a lot, but I, I'm not vibing with any of this right now. I do like that circle logo on the t-shirt on the left-hand side of your chest. Beanie's dope. Hat, no. And then the old stuff. Twitch chat, I'm happy to report. None of this is speaking to me. I'm going to skip the LA Thieves drop. None of that is speaking to me. It's salad, Geo. Salad? Salad. Okay. Salad. It's not what I want out of my 100 Thieves drop, so I'm not into it. But, Barrett, so two big things happened. One, I wore one of my 100 Thieves hoodies out skiing and snowboarding. Now, I usually don't do that. I don't like putting any of my stuff at risk, but I did wear my dope breast cancer uh, awareness foundation pink hoodie out there, which I really, really love. I, you know, that's an eye grabber. That's a showstopper. Then on the flip side, Barrett, I wore my boots for the first time. So I bought what? three pairs of shoes recently because everybody teased me for having only one pair of shoes. Everybody teased me. Now the issue came. But most of I got these two. I'm going to be honest. You know what, Baron? I'm going to actually blow your mind because I think I need five pairs of shoes. And I'll okay. break it down for what? you in a second. Why? I'm going to break it down for you in a How second. How did you Baird. go from I one need, to five? I need five pairs, I've decided. But here's the catch. I finally wore the shoes because then I had the crippling anxiety of, I'm going to leave these shoes in the box because I don't want to ruin them, right? But it's like, Mike, why you buy boots if you're not going to wear the boots up on the mountain where yeah, exactly. it's cold and wet? And I was like, no, I'm not going to do it. You know what I mean? But I did. I did. So I wore the boots. So here's why I need five pairs. You ready? I need you to clear your mind and think about why I need these five pairs of shoes. Okay, so I'm going to start off and I'm going to break your mind for a little bit. Okay, ready? Here's how it goes. I have a pair of athletic shoes. Your basic Nike running shoes. Okay. okay. So imagine these shoes as your just basic, easy, everyday wear. You go into the studio, you go into work, you're walking down the block with Lulu, right? Mm. Then I bought a pair of nice, dope Nikes that are like you're kind of, we're going out to the movie, so we're going to a dinner date yeah. type shoes, right? Then I also bought boots for the snow for a rainy day in San Francisco, right? So I'm at three pairs of shoes. Three. So now okay. get why I need two more pairs. Se se next pair is I need a second pair of going out slash like, nicer shoes because yeah, you, you, my you know issue, like not everything yep. is gonna not every shoe is gonna fit with every outfit stuff like exactly. that you need to, you need, need some variety thank you Bear. There. okay because i bought i bought black nikes and i think i need a pair of white nikes okay so both these shoes one pair is black one pair is white they're going out shoes right okay. they're just okay. nice they're they're not dress shoes they're just nice comfortable yeah. they're clean they look good right okay now i want you to focus on the athletic shoes so the catch is, is on the athletic shoes, I need a second pair because that's going to be your gym pair of shoes. These are the ones you're going to get sweaty, stanky in. And I don't want the everyday shoe. Like if I show up to the studio, I don't want those running shoes to be sweaty and stanky. You know what I mean? That's so I need, fair. I need a dedicated pair of running and like athletic shoes. Okay. That's fair. I, I, so would, I need just, five I would, pairs. Five pairs. Because here's how it would boil down for me, right? Is mm -hmm, that like... Mm -hmm. I'd have my everyday shoes, and those everyday shoes are going to be used for walking. They're going to be used for, yeah, walking Lulu. They're going to be used for um, uh, going to the gym. They're going to be used for okay, just, like, okay. just random everyday kind of shit. Um, and then the kind of like going out shoes are like, those are the shoes I'm wearing to work. And granted, okay, all of my okay. shoes are typically Vans, so it doesn't mm -hmm. really matter. But, yeah, like, I, I want to, like, dedicate of, like, all right, this is, like, this is a pair I don't really care about, like, what happens to them. Mm -hmm. um, mm -hmm. And then, like, these pairs, it's like, all right, we're 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 saving this on, like, I'm going out to drinks with friends or, you know, like, we're going out to, to a game night or something right like that, right? Um, yes. And so those I would have two pairs of. So, again, mm -hmm. I said the most you need is three. For me, it's actually two. So, yeah. Okay. There you go. For two, okay. But you, you vibe with the fives. So that's where I'm at. I need five right now. I'm decided. Five shoes. Five pairs of shoes, everybody. Five pairs of shoes. <laughs> and I'm going to add a six pair of shoe, but we haven't gotten to that point yet. And those are the nice dress shoes, okay? That's like 
Mike well, hosting those the Dice don't count. Awards, okay? Those don't count because Mike it's going like to a wedding. Dre- yeah, stuff. dress shoes. I don't feel like count because it's mm-hmm. like you got to have those for special you gotta occasions. Have you got to have those. Them, aren't right? like something them. that are in the rotation throughout mm-hmm. the week, right? But you got to have them in the back pocket, right? You got to have them in the back pocket. Okay, I um, I think we're about to get to a boss fight. Okay, good because I've completely lost track of all. We're say we're gonna save <laughs> Nipple Lady. All of this. <laughs> We're, uh, Nipple Lady got captured by some, some scary monsters. Okay, 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 okay. Her. I think she was like the Oracle of, uh, Athens. Oh, uh, okay, 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 we need to help. Oh, no, not a boss fight, just... No, we're just gonna fight more. some ugly harpies. Which we've already fought at this big, point, right? Harpy. Uh, yeah, you've been murdering yeah, yeah, some we of fought those. these yeah, fucking dudes already. These, these little bat things, yeah. Hopefully, a big one shows up. You know yeah, I mean? maybe. Yeah, we fought these on the the rooftop. Oh no! Here we go. All right, we got a Medusa. They're throwing some other shit in the mix here. Get me away from the Medusa. Get me away from her. There you go. Give her the lightning bolts. Yeah, yeah. Get me away from her. Get me away from her. Get me away from her. Keep dodging. Keep dodging. There we go. There we go. Oh, <laughs> last class game and make me die. Be adding things explaining the attention. <laughs> 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 we counting sandals and slides? No. Sandals, slides, and like Barrett said with the dress shoes. Those are one-offs, right? The dress shoes you're gonna buy, they're gonna be in a box for the special oh occasions. Oh my God, there's another one. Sl- sandals and slides, those are just there for the beach. You know what I mean? There's a, those are there for that backyard barbecue relaxing moment. Yeah. But those we won't count. Those yeah, that's like, that's like counting count. like slippers. Like I don't count yeah, slippers. Yeah, we're not counting slippers. Even though I have dope pairs of slippers. We don't count. Oh yeah. I need a good pair of slippers, Mike. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. All right, we've run out of magic he's buying shoes. us all slippers before uh, we go into the studio, so. Hold off, he's gonna buy us all slippers. Who is? Kevin. Joey uh Joey convinced Kevin that we all need slippers. Mm. That's a good good job, Joey. That mm-hmm. was a good uh mm-hmm. everybody gets a pair of slippers. I want mugs. Those are man uggs. I really want those bad. Man uggs, okay. Uh huh, yeah, I, I don't what want like them... slipper slippers, I want slippers that go half. What up makes my them calf. for men? Well, I think they're just a bigger size, that's all. They're literally just Uggs, but men's sizes, so they call uh, them Bugs. Okay. I want bugs. bugs. I want Bugs really bad. Uh-oh. Good I also good might have good. just made that up. Good. <laughs> you chosen wisely. I knew it was so. Who are you? So, you have the blades. The skin as pale as the moon. You are the one indeed. Perhaps Athens will survive. I didn't know that. Deckard Cain was in this game as well. <laughs> That's a Diablo reference, Raliella. <laughs> dying before I'm done with this grave. A grave? In the middle of a battle? Who will occupy it, old man? You will, my son. Oh, I've got a lot of digging to do indeed. Oh, dang. All will be revealed in good time. And when we're gonna all die, dude. To be lost, Kratos, Guys, just out here telling you you're gonna die. It's like to sad news for you, homie. I got four more video games to go through, so we're definitely not dead <laughs> yet. That's a big grave. All right. Big hole. That could definitely fit your body. You'd be in there. Yeah. You'd be in there. That wasn't that big of a fight right there, I'm gonna say. Well, we just no. did. No, no. Bunch of somebody had... little bats and you know a couple medusas like. No. They gave it. They made it feel like such a big moment that I was about to go into. And I was just like, all right. Someone in the chat said that there's three distinct bosses in this, and you're gonna know them. So. Oh, okay. All right. Did we already fight one boss? Yeah, we fought the big, we fought the fought the big water monster already. Yeah. So we definitely fought area. one. Yeah, yeah. yeah. There we go. More coordinates. Bear, what do you do? Somebody brought up. What do you do if you do step and poo with your shoes? Are you a Bring it out to the hose Ugh. and try to like toothbrush it out with like with a toothbrush you can throw away, or is it like, hey, these shoes are trash and you just chuck them? I think you know I think I mean? it Where depends. Do you fall on that? It depends on a lot of different factors. I think it depends on the material of the shoe, how easy it is okay, to get the okay, poop out. Okay. I think how old is the shoe? Because um, mm, it was mm-hmm. recent that like uh, I had my checkerboard uh, vans. This was probably like 
four months ago at this point. But they were like an old pair of vans, uh, checkerboard, and I okay, okay. we took Lulu to the dog park, and I un- did not notice that um, mm-hmm. I had stepped in poop. And it was just like one of those like, all right, well, we're at the park. I got to drive home. <laughs> Like, I'm not going to, like, be in the car with these uh, poopy shoes. These shoes are old as fuck, too. So, like, I just kind of – I tossed them. I drove uh, home barefoot mm-hmm. um, and then ordered uh, a new pair of checkerboard and, and kind of talked that oh, out yeah. to, like, it, it was okay. time. It was time, you know. Um, like if that. they're If they're like newer, that. if they're newer and you think it's worth it, um, you go, you know, try it out. But, again, not all material I think is easy to get poo, uh, poo off of. Someone was saying, like, just hose mm. them down. Yeah, strategy works for the bottom, the but if it makes its way, if it's a poop that oh, like if it's you the step top. in, yeah, 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 Ooh. and it like gets to the side of the shoe where you're getting to the you know the actual like uh, um, material of the shoe, not just mm-hmm, the sole. Mm-hmm. That's when you're going to be in a little bit of trouble, and then you need to start uh, you know thinking about your priorities of if this is a shoe worth saving or not. So it's a it's a it's a difficult question. I think it's situational. Yeah, no, here's one for you, Barry. You know. I feel like me stepping in gum has drastically gone down. Have people stopped spitting their gum out on the streets where I'm not stepping on gum anymore? I feel like maybe that's like an elementary, I, middle yeah, school. Yeah, I was going to say, thing, I think that's like I mean? a like, school thing where like, like kids just fucking spit not, gum on yeah. like the floor of like the hallways in their school. Because I will say yeah. in my adult life, I don't come across mm-hmm. that nearly as much. Yeah, you, you look at the soles of your shoes, you haven't stepped in gum in a long time. What's up with that? Why? What's up with the massive drop off of gum on this? The gum industry is going down. Gum they've been, they've going been, down. Everybody's been waiting to hear Andy's hot takes mm. on gum, and mm. the gum industry has halted ever since. I miss those Altoid mints, bro. Not the not the spicy ones that like suck to eat, but the fruity ones that everybody loved. Where they were like, "Hey, this isn't candy," and we just ate it like candy in the way. You know what those are called? Oh, no, I didn't mean to. Okay, there we go. Okay, there we go. Oh. Oh, my God, they just keep coming. They keep spawning. Am I not supposed to just keep fighting them like this? It's almost no, kind of the confusing thing. Off. Yeah, they got to die off of it. Well, they, they do. Maybe they do keep coming. That's right. They, just keep, they keep coming out of this hole in the wall. Am I supposed to plug up the hole? Is it that deep of a game chat, or is it? Am I thinking too much about it? You know, someone was saying a puzzle. Mm, puzzle, solve it. Someone says yep, but like you're not saying yep to which thing. I gave you two options, and all you say is yes. So that yep. makes me think it's both options. That's like when I was like, where where are these Marvel shows going? And everybody just told me two different things. It's like, <laughs> all right, that's great. That's great. Apparently, I gotta block it. Can I, like, break this pillar? Yeah, they're just gonna keep coming out. So I gotta, I gotta find a different thing. Have you ever taken your shoes? Here's one thing that people talk about, but I've never actually done. Have you actually ever taken your shoes and chucked them in the washing machine and, like, full-on washed your shoes? So I feel like at that point, I'm just throwing them away. I don't know if I have. Okay. I've never I've never done that. I've never done that. Andy does that? Interesting. No wonder why the, the dryer shakes <laughs> so much when he does laundry. <laughs> I did see the TikTok though about the one guy who was like, here's something I wish I learned when I was before my thirties. And when you when you're supposed to dry your shoes, you're actually supposed to like tie the laces up in a knot and then you hang them inside the door and like outside is the laces yeah, so it holds them in place to... and then it just spins around them getting them hot instead of just letting them bang and ruining the things. That's right. Oh, the shit behind here. Oh, shit. Oh, snap. Not is this what thing. I'm using to block the... Uh... I think it is. I think it is. What? What the fuck was that? Showing me that, like, yeah, like these things keep coming out. Interesting. Yeah, like, how am I supposed to fucking you do that? I've never done that. Dry your shoes in a low oven. <laughs> there we go. 
But this is like the box thing. Like, don't make me fucking do this and like have to deal with like damage from these fucking bats. These hearts sucks. Bats. Charles Jacobson, that's a true thing. But remember, in 2022, the goal is simple. It's to step out of your comfort zone. Step out of the box and try new things. So, Charles, I'm happy to report that I've worn new shoes. I've also worn clothes that I normally wouldn't wear. So, you know what? We'll try new things, Big John. I'm having sushi once a week to once every two weeks. Whoa. So shout out to me. I'm going to the bar and getting a drink at the bar, which I never do. Shout Whoa. out to me. You know what I mean? Never do that. Had a margarita recently. Enjoyed it. There you go. That's that what it's all about. Mark. You love to see it. A little marg. A little marg. I like something sweet. I'm on the sweeter side of the drinks that I want to try. You know what I mean? On the sweet side. Oh my god. Let me fucking grab the thing. There we go. Today I'm at. Tonight I'm actually gonna go battle Susie at the blackjack table and try to win instead of lose. So mm. I anticipate that being a fun night of screaming and yelling. Against good old Susie, undefeated. Against Susie, <laughs> with a hundred percent undefeated man, always taking all the money. Right, there we go. We did it. We did it. We figured out the puzzle. Solid. You love to see it. See, we're yeah, you gamers figured it out. You figured it out. You figured it out. You got that. Alright. <laughs> I hope Susie is an 87 year old woman who plays blackjack every night. <laughs> Susie is the 63 year old woman who just wants to retire at the local casino and is dealing blackjack to jabronis like me. All right, so you, they weren't far off. <laughs> uh, they're not, no. And I like to bring in my strategies from GTA Online where nothing actually matters into a place where it really does matter and I mess up. So I'll get two tens, right? And that's 20, man. That's called an instant win, really. And then I look at yeah. her and I go, split them. And she goes, you shouldn't do that. And I go, split up, double the fuck. You're insane, then, Mike. Then they get mad at me. Yeah. Oh, I, I wasn't supposed you to. You got to do it, baby. You're absolutely split, insane. Split them. Split them. <laughs> <laughs> and then, and then like, so this hands. is the other thing. So <laughs> now we really got to figure this out. Because, like, you spend so much fucking money. You, oh, you're terrible oh. at gambling, apparently. Oh, it's terrible, terrible. So it's I don't like, much. Oh, that's so I think the only thing we know is, is that like you're you're a drug dealer. Is that, that there we, we have go. to assume? There we go. That's, there that's... we go. We can put that out there. Put that out there. <laughs> put that out. Yeah, I look forward to that tonight with Susie seeing what's up with that. You know what I mean? Will I walk up to the scary craps table, Barrett? Probably craps not. is too much, man. I look at it and everybody's always cheering and screaming, and it's just like I don't understand what's happening, and so I walk away. I walk away, you know what I mean? I walk away. There we go. <clears throat> oh, what's up there? What's up there? Oh, you're gonna make that jump? Oh! 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 Whoa, 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 whoa! Be easy now, be easy! Ooh! -wee. We got a lot of chests in this video game. A lot of chests. A lot of, a lot of collectibles. Like, what, what do they got? What? Is, oh, the, these these Gorgon eyes oh, yeah, that, uh, oh, yeah. you know, help uh, fill up, I think, my health. And then the feathers, I think, uh, help fill up my magic. Maybe it might be the other way around. I forget. Mike is the biggest kingpin in Tahoe. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I Tahoe you. needs a kingpin, you know. You gotta have one. Someone's gotta, gotta, gotta be. Someone's Learn gotta be. Learn from the bets. Learn from the. Might as well be Mike, right? God damn it! Uh, thank you to... to Mr. Gordon for the Prime Game stuff for eight months. What's going on? Thank you so much. Speaking of Mr. And, uh, Gordon. Mike, I yeah, finally yeah. finished my uh, my Batman uh, my Batmanathon, where I all watched of them. We, you watched I all watched of them. 26 Batman movies in the last 26, month to get uh, hype for the Batman next okay. week, man. Mm -hmm. I'm so fucking next week, the Batman. And I saw uh, uh, people uh, sharing on Twitter, like uh, I think there was like screeners like last night, um, and people are saying there's a review embargo of 8 a.m. on Monday. 
And so I'm, I'm stoked to see what people have to say about this movie. I'm, okay. I'm, I'm okay. in like the, I'm in the peak of hype right now. Mm, peak of hype. I'm very excited because I'm going to go to my local movie theater, which is very small. With Sad Boy Sean. Never play, with Sad Boy Sean. And they never play the movie loud enough so I can't hear anything. Uh, and my eyes are going so bad, Barrett, that I am happy to report I always sit on the front row, front row of the second section, right? The good section where you want to be, not the yeah, front, front row, yeah, right? Yeah. But I sit on the front row of the se- of the second section where you can hang your feet off where they have like the in between the handicap areas, right? And I can't see. It's fuzzy. Oh. It's blurry. I can't make. Where are your anything. fucking glasses in the theater, dude? What <laughs> are you I doing? Look, Who are you trying to I impress? Wanna at, I want to look at Samuel Shaw and be like, we have to sit in the bottom section. <laughs> <laughs> Why would you do that to him? We have to crank our neck because I can't see anything, Sean. It, I'm trying to watch Jackass forever. I can't make out if that's Johnny Knoxville or if that's Steve-O because they're all so blurry. Oh, Everybody's face God. is blurry. Just wear your glasses to the theater. <laughs> what is wrong with you, Mike? Never. <laughs> and so I'm excited to see the Batman and wonder what's going on on this oh screen right God. now. I You're can't a make monster. it out. You're an absolute monster. I just blame it on my movie theater. I just I don't think the screen. <laughs> yeah, is the, it's enough. out of fo- it's the screen's out of, focus. It's God. out of focus. I forget what was the last movie I saw. I think it might have been Spider Man. I think it was No Way Home because I remember sitting next to Nick, and both of us noticed right before the movie that the projector was off by like a couple of inches and it bothered both of us the entire way through it it got to like nick right like during the trailers nick got up to like talk to somebody about it because we both noticed it and we're like no one else probably notices this but we notice it and it bothers the fuck out of us (laughs) because you know nick is you know uh 40 something years old i think you know i'm 27 but we're both 60 year old italian men old at heart Um, heart. and so we were just like ah we're not going to be able to focus because the projector is off by just a little bit. <laughs> um, and they couldn't do anything about it. Man. They couldn't do anything yep. about it. Apparently, it was too late to what? line up the projector. I don't fucking no, know. No, you got to yeah. scooch that over. Bro. See, maybe that's my issue. Maybe they just don't have it out of focus. Maybe it's not my eyesight. Maybe it's them yeah. just not doing it right. You know yeah, I mean? maybe so they're just not doing them. their job. You know, I'm going to show up and blame it on yeah, them. Yeah, I think I'm seeing the Batman twice next week, and I'm stoked. So I'm, I'm okay. seeing it with okay. the, the KF crew at some point next week. And I got tickets uh, for myself and uh, one Jonathan Dornbush for next oh, weekend. Oh wow, a, a little uh, double birthday! Yeah, we're yeah, right we're, we're, we're we're gonna do a little uh, a little boys uh, date during the day. I'm excited. I like that. Oh, we're still chasing her down. Yeah, we gotta we gotta. Oh, oh God! Oh no! <gasps> oh shit! Okay. Wow, How long are you gonna be able to hold on to that? Look at that. Big map. Those employees are liars. <laughs> Alright, I gotta pull these fucking things again? What's going on here? What's the puzzle here? I need the layout of the land here. Get a lay of the land. Get a lay of the land. As the people say. Is there anything behind them? No. Okay. I'm gonna need them for something, I assume. Mm-hmm. We've got an owl thing. Oh shit, okay, that's an elevator. See, here's the thing, lady. There's like this puzzle I gotta figure out, so you're just gonna have to like hold on tight. Is that like a ladder? There's a time limit. Oh shit! Make a ladder. I think someone says there's a time limit. Mm -hmm. (laughs) Uh oh. Uh oh. All right, so we're gonna put this down here. Oh wow. Okay, that's something. Oh. Um. Yeah, you know, a lot of people are saying, Mike, wait for it to be streamed on TikTok, and I look forward to that. <laughs> Whoever is willing to put their account Y'all online are fucking and stream it monsters. on TikTok, I'm sure I'll watch it with the chat, you know what I mean? And the best part about TikTok, Bear, right, is the chat takes up like 80% of the screen. So it's just nothing but words on top of Spidey's face while we're Don't having watch an emotional the Batman moments. like this. Even from the trailers, <laughs> you can tell it's going to be like this fucking, like, the cinematography is going to be like, <laughs> Bonkers! It's gonna be. Ugh, I fucking yeah, hate but Fat you. Boy Slim isn't telling me about how much he loves the Batman in it. You know what I mean? <laughs> Donut Boy sixty nine isn't going. Oh man, this is the greatest experience ever. Absolute monster! Can't wait! Can't wait! All that juice says I respect it. There it is. Get all that juice. There it is. This is uh this I is think good this right is here. The, I think this is the solution. If it's I, not I she's fucked. 
We've gotten much lower than where she is. All right, hold on, hold That's on, hold not on. what I thought we'd be doing. Hold on, everybody. Okay. Uh, okay, while Bear takes a moment and he resets, I am happy to announce, though, a movie that I can actually physically see is going down next Thursday night. Me, James, Elise, and Nick Scarpino are sitting down for an 80s action movie night. We're watching RoboCop with all of you to kick off the brand new month, which I'm really, really excited about. We got everybody's schedules to line up. So we'll return for another 80s action movie night with all of you on Thursday night. And I'll be able to see that movie y'all, so get ready. It's gonna be a great time. Love to see it. All right, all right, all right. I think this is it. Oh, oh, wow, you did that. Oh, wow. Oh, look at you. I would love the not terrible, um, oh, camera angle. fuck. Okay, okay. Yeah, I would like some more control on the camera angle, you know? Mm -hmm. Okay, mm -hmm. okay. Mm -hmm. We're going to make it a little further spread out here. Chat, do you know what the time limit is? What are you doing? I'm five here. minutes. Is it five it's minutes? Fine. There's not a time limit. Someone it's in the chat time. said time limit, so I'm going to assume she's going to fucking fall. I mean, you're moving so fast. Ah, oh, God damn wow. it. See, oh, that's wow. the, this is the problem with the fucking that's camera angles. That's a PlayStation angles. 2 mechanic. That's a PlayStation 2 mechanic. <laughs> Bad camera angles. All right, all right, all right. Now, I know people have been um, uh -huh. asking about another anime movie night, Mikey. Mm -hmm. And mm -hmm. I know what mm -hmm. we said was when the next My Hero movie comes to streaming. Yep, that's what I want to watch it. is My we Hero. Do it. We'll, do a, we'll do an anime movie night for God. World's Heroes or whatever the fuck it's called. Um, that, see, I want to do My Hero because then we can get with the chat and we can ask them what they want their their quirks to be. Mm -hmm. And like see, see what everybody be, is. Are you a, fun a hero? Time. Are you a villain? You know what I mean? Yeah. Oh my gosh! Yeah, there's still no word. Are you no hanging word. out with the League of Villains? Uh, there's still no word oh. on. Massive jump. Oh! Oh! oh God damn it! Bro. Is there anything else that I'm missing? I don't think there's anything else that I'm really missing here. No, I think it's just the jump, bro. Right? No way there's a time limit this long and they don't put the time on screen. Fair. All right. But I got got in the chat. No! Well, God I damn it. it. I wouldn't believe it. Uh, Shinzo, this question is for you. He says, hell yeah, Robocop's a legit good movie. Now the question is, will it be my new number one on my 80s action movie ranking list, which is Lethal Weapon? Let me know if it's going to be better than Lethal Weapon. Because every time now, almost every time, We've had a new number one as we've watched all these movies. I think back to Bloodsport. Definitely got shafted. Bloodsport did not do that. Um, Running Man was very good. Demolition Man was good. I really enjoyed Point Break and Top Gun and Roadhouse. But uh, we'll see if this one can take the number one spot. Nice yeah, job. Got another Gorgon nice eye. Nice job. Boy. We got these eyes. We got these eyeballs. What's going on over here? I'm gonna lock on the door of the symbol of the Oracle cart, so she's gonna help me get in. She's there. gonna open up that lock. Oh, yeah, yeah. There we go. There we go. All right, we're doing oh. something. We're doing oh, something. Oh, you're just gonna beat the video game without them even knowing. Oh, no, nope, never mind. No, no, okay. I thought that would have been it, you know? Hmm. Don't you have to stack them? I gotta stack them? How? Oh, snap. One, at, one dropped on top of the other one? Oh, maybe. Really, though? Really, like this, though? Like this, like this. Hold on, hold on. So we'll put this here. If it doesn't work, I'm not taking responsibility. John of Legend, if this doesn't work, you're banned forever. Boy Barnacle, you will see me play Elden Ring very soon. Uh, myself and Andy next week are actually going to play co-op on stream with all of you. So you'll see a lot of that. Me and Andy probably this weekend as well. We'll play co-op together because uh, I really love Elden Ring. But I play that stuff co-op. I don't bang my head against the wall losing to these jabronis. Okay, there we go. Oh, there you go. Okay. Now what? I don't know. You're going to push that into the middle and try to jump probably? Ooh. You know what yeah. I mean? Yeah. Yeah, there you go. There you go, Mikey. Yeah. Fucking nailed it. 
So like there? Like there? Yeah, I think so. I don't so. know. I don't I, I don't I don't know what the we'll process is. We'll test the waters. We'll test the waters. I'm trying, lady. No! No! Oh, a lot of that. A lot of moments like that. A lot of tough moments like that. That lady has a good grip, says Chris Scott. Yes, she does. All right, where am I going from here? Oh, I, see what? now the camera angle's messed up. It's like working against that, me. Pull that out a little bit and maybe more to the right. Yeah, maybe like I think over you have here. To there jump was to that the right one can. There was that camera angle that was yeah, like. Yeah, there's a ledge there too. That uh, with a that torches. That's where I'm thinking you're jumping. I can't even see where she is, though, 8-Bit Louise. Yeah, Kratos could catch her. Yeah, it's too far. Massive. It's too, too far, far, too far, too far, too far. The torches lead the way? Torches lead the way. So what, over here? Red Warrior is about to die. There's no way. Wait, how are you going to get to that? Because I can't Kratos, make this way. jump. You have to get to me. Right? Oh, I can! Oh, oh, psych, we broke it. Got it. I'm dumb. Alright. What is this dude? Help me, oh, God, she's so far please. up! I don't know, lady. This might be the end. <laughs> this might be for the end for you. Ah! Oh! Oh, wow, she almost fell. You must get here See, that's when you gotta, like, loop your leg up in it, too, you know what I mean? Like, you gotta do anything you can. If you're gonna hang there, you gotta, like, loop yourself up in there. Oh, yeah. Oh, my God. I gotta get, like, you all of this, lady. I think you're just gonna have to die on this one. I'm sorry. Like, Baird, have you ever had dreams of you becoming an aerialist where, like, you, you, you know, you wrap yourself up in the linen while you climb it up to the rooftop and then you drop really fast, but it catches you because... Oh, no, there is a time limit. Point, right? Ooh, 60 seconds. Thought about that before. I think I can do it. Okay, you're easy peasy, bro. Easy peasy. Oh, get there! Nice. Oh! Everybody climbs so slowly. There we go. Get off of there. No, get off. off that fool. Let it drop. Drop it down. There we go. Oh my god, we only have 30 seconds now. I don't think you're making this. I, don't, I think she's gonna die. There we go. No! Oh! 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 No! You got the bottom of it! That was a massive grab. Come on, come on! Oh! First try, baby! Let's go! Kratos How did the, the cutscene has completely changed what this character looks like? Kratos, as a the PS2, Mike. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> but you are late. Perhaps too late to save Athens. Oh or my gosh. is it Athens you have come to save? No! I, I can't! We must not stop! And when the Oracle looked into his soul, she saw a beast as well as a man. Once a captain in the Spartan army, Kratos had begun his command with only 50 soldiers. Oh, but wow. Soon his numbers grew to the thousands. His tactics were brutal, but effective. Oh! Drunk with power, he was feared by all, except one. His wife was the only one to brave his fury. How much is enough, Kratos? When will it end? When the glory of Sparta is known throughout the world. And the Spart glory of Sparta. You did this for yourself. His desire for conquest knew no bounds. But that which he desired would ultimately consume him. By the gods, why would Athena send one such as you? Stay out of my head! Oh my god! Choose your enemies wisely, Kratos. Your brute strength alone will not be enough to destroy Ares. Only one item in the world will allow you to defeat a god. 
Pandora's box, which lies far beyond the walls of Athens, hidden by the gods across the desert to the east. But be warned, Kratos. Many have gone in search of Pandora's box. None have returned. All right, then. Snap. All right, well, we got to go on a journey, then. We're leaving Athens. What if it just became an open world adventure all of a sudden? You just go out into the desert, it's like, it's open world now. Good luck. <laughs> <laughs> so, oh, you didn't know we had it like that 15 years ago. Yeah, yeah. What's going on here? Yeah, I think this is our... Oh, shit. Yeah, we're going to, like, go to, a, like, a fucking different area completely. Thank you, 30-something, for the gifted tier one sub out there. Thank you. <clears throat> All righty. Yeah, we'll save here. Now, chat, I'm going to leave it up to you. Right now, we've got 30 extra minutes on the stream, close to 45. Um, that means if we start now, we would have an hour at all. Do we want to start yep, now? Yep. Do we want to wait a half Someone hour? Get the pole up. Get the pole up. Someone I put pull the pole it out. Up. I'm putting the pole up. Okay. What you want to see? Pulls up for 60 seconds. Get your voice heard right now. We've filled up the bar halfway. We're so close. Thank you to so many people. Mitchell Hop just according right now. 30-something with the gift of sub. Remember, with your support, we can go for that extra hour right now. Barrett is at literally the beginning of Elden Ring. He has not even jumped into the open world yet. <laughs> so you will not be spoiled by anything insane. You will see the beginning of Elden Ring with Barrett. But vote right now. Let us know what you want to see for this final hour it's right now. It's a good now. fight it's a right one. now. Wow. It's a close one. It's closer so, than I thought. Neck and neck battle right now. 44 to 42. Make your voices heard if you want to get involved. 48, 46. Oh my gosh. It's going to come down. Final 15 seconds. Wow. Right now, y'all. Oh my God. It can't be any closer. We have now had Kratos take over by oh, five votes. But it's back. It's fourth, it's back, it's fourth. Oh my God, it's gonna oh! happen. Whoa, my God. Elden Ring, Elden Ring wins votes. out. Cause I, I feel like we're at a good More stopping Kratos, point. 62. We're at a wow. good stopping point right now in uh, God of War, right? We gotta go, okay, we, okay, we gotta go okay. find Pandora's box. Um, okay, okay, and I feel like we can okay. save that for next time, you know? Okay, Bar Barrett's gonna make the change. We're gonna switch on over to Elden Ring. Right now we are an hour and about 39 minutes on the stream. We have an additional 30 minutes right now. We can fill up, or I should say an additional 45 bear. Actually, yeah, that's yeah. the wrong bar. Remember that. We have an additional 45 right now. If we fill up this bar, we'll go for the full hour. We'll add on to the monthly goal total for me to play Zelda Breath of the Wild with all of you. And I'm going to be honest with you. I want to do that because, Bear, as I see it, right, it's a great way for me to connect with the chat to make an awesome lasting memory, but also to bring in people like yourself, other people from the industry, and be like, yo, what makes Zelda so cool to you? And also help me with this video game because I don't know what I'm doing. And we can learn together and have some fun. So we'll see what happens right now. But we are going switched on over to Elden Ring. Oh, you already switched it? You're wild, man. Oh, Thank yeah. You. At the end also, of the shout out, the quick game might not have been. Look at the things that I bought, oh, y'all. Just remember the things that I bought. I want everybody to see the cool things that I bought. Because I don't get to show it off to anybody, Barrett, so I got to show it off here. You know what I mean? <laughs> don't forget about the things that I bought. Yeah, I bought stuff. I bought stuff. And it's kind of cool. It's cool to me. All right, we're I loading in. I cool stuff. I didn't know that I had to, like, select a uh, quit game. Oh, God. It's, like, it's fucking dark in here, man. Okay, yeah. I remember this. Okay, this is the thing that's f fucking me up. I want to, like, press in L3 to run, but that's his crouch. Tree. Oh, thanks. Does the tree uh, do anything? No? Okay. God, his dodge roll is rough. Thank you. Thank you. I, I like showing off my cool stuff. I like the show and tell vibe of it all. All of us having some fun, you know what I mean? We're having a good time. All right, so this is where I got to earlier. I went to this guy. Yeah, I went to the site okay. of grace. Yeah, and welcome that's, to the that, site And that's where I ended. 
Okay, aka a bonfire. So just so everybody yeah, knows, yeah, yeah. this is literally the beginning right here. I've played 10 hours of only co-op, so I can uh, definitely at least guide Barrett from the beginning, tell you some of the basics. Um, yeah, I got my my regular swing. If I hold down R2, right? Like, oh, shit. Yep, yep, yep. There he is. There he is. Mike, tell enemy. my wife we need a ping pong table. Yo, D Fuller, I will gladly help you out and tell your wife why all of the awesome benefits of a ping pong table is much needed in your house. Coming from a man who used to have my dining room table as a pool table, Barrett, I'm all about having a <laughs> ping pong slash pool table in one's oh, house. Shit. So I will gladly help you out with that, D Fuller. <clears throat> oh, all man. the benefits of it. I'm kicking these guys' butts. Easy game, y'all. Easy game. Hickey, thank you so much for the tier one stuff for 11 months. What's going on, my friend? How are you? Thank you for the support. Oh, I need to get used to, yeah, I need to get used to parrying. Yeah, I know the, oh, there's a backstab. Oh, that's nice. Mm -hmm. Backstab. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, nope. No, that was not it. That was not it. Now you got to get behind him. Got to get him behind him. Well, I was trying to I was trying to figure out the the parrying timing, you know. Mm, yeah, the timing is always difficult. Timing is always difficult. Yeah. Now, I'm a short and <laughs> board guy. This is the thing that's fucking me up now because we've been playing God of War for like the first hour and a half, right, Mike? Uh huh. Is that like now I'm used to like not being able to control the camera? <laughs> oh yeah, now you so have like, to control the camera yeah. at the same time. Yep. God uh -huh, damn it, uh -huh. dude. Uh, Mike, hey, are we gonna get the Destiny 2 stream or Fortnite? Destiny 2, you will not get Oh, Matt what the Cat. fuck? Uh, but it will be on Twitch, because I did that. That was just a side thing. Uh, if you do really want that, let me know, Matt Cat. Maybe I can download it and put it up, but no. That was just its own special thing. The Fortnite one, I don't know why they wouldn't have put that up, but I'll ask Kevin and the gang, uh, what's up with the Fortnite one to see if we can get that up on the plays. But, uh, yeah, this week on plays... A little bit quieter than normal, right? We had the Monday stream of Kane and Lynch. Tuesday, you had the PlayStation XOXO TakeOver. <clears throat> Wednesday and Thursday, I've been off. But Thursday, I know you got yours. So I'll let them know. Will you review Witch Queen? Uh, Lord Navarone, we will have Paris on today's X-Cast. He will give us our early impressions of the oh, Witch shit. Queen. And then like maybe on the X-Cast, we could talk about a review depending on Myself in Paris on where he's feeling, but uh, I don't know if you'll get that on Gamescast, right, Barrett? I don't think any of them are really playing that on Gamescast. I don't believe so. Yeah, maybe Greg, if uh, if Greg continues it. Yeah. it, but yeah, I don't I don't think that's gonna be like a, a kind of funny yeah. <clears throat> games review, you know? Would you try any other Souls games in co-op? Uh, Hippity or hit by a parked car? Yo, hit by a parked car? What up, homie? Uh, I've played every single Dark Souls game in co-op so i would recommend it yes if that's what you like to do this is the best dark okay. souls game for co-op because it's much easier to get your friends involved and uh get everybody together playing the other ones are very tedious and difficult and a time uh, waster but uh, i've played all the dark souls games oh there we go co-op oh yeah that felt good that felt good look at that Just got him yeah you're fucking dead dude you got him with the stun bro fucking dead um Donway, what you talking about, Donway? I've already played Metal Gear Solid Five. Where were you, bro? Where were you? I was playing Metal Gear Solid Five. I played it. Been there. Been there, done that. Been there, done that, big dog. I've I freaking saved the world, bro, bro. I've been there. Oh, this feels good. Oh God, yeah, that does lock that man, bro. That parry is. I'm not good at it. Not good whatsoever. Oh, here's this man. Yeah, you fucking thought. Yo, Cuzzy P, that's the question. When do I start Metal Gear Solid 6? That's a great question, Cuzzy P. I don't know. You know what I mean? I don't know. It'll be a tough <laughs> one. It'll be a tough one. We'll see. You know what I mean? Because, like, Metal Gear Solid 5 was so good. You know, can 6 follow up with that? And I'm a little worried. I'm a little worried. Is the, I don't think there's a 6. I think that's it, Mike. Yeah, I got people all uptight because Barrett did end. So Metal Gear Solid <clears throat> is broken into chapters. And so one of the chapters ended that I beat. And I was like, hey, great job, everybody. I look forward to Metal Gear Solid 6. And they went wild. They got really uptight at me. And I was like, I guess we're going to have to wait for see what Kojima does. So 
I have to go back eventually and beat the next chapter. We'll see, though. I'm just trying to figure out this fucking, this parry right here, Mike. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Work on your parry. Work on your parry. Work on it. <clears throat> low stakes uh, Elden Ring right here, you know? Just low stakes. I've already accidentally uh, drinking my uh, two of my three health potions. Mm -hmm, you know? mm -hmm. You've been chugging flasks. Right. Uh -huh, <laughs> accidentally. Uh -huh. All right. Crouch. Do a little crouchy crouch. Chat got absolutely triggered by that. <laughs> oh, yeah, they went wild, bro. It was a great time. It was a great time. Yeah, you're fucking dead, dude. Well, can I, like, <clears throat> well, I can go in, like, tall grass and shit yeah, now, Mike? Uh -huh, what? Uh huh. It's pretty cool, right? It's pretty cool. They've added some really cool stuff. No Dice Awards content? Yeah, Donway. I mean, Greg Miller hosted the thing. And then we, of course, hosted uh, Greg Miller last night. Me and Joey were in the chat hanging out with a couple of best friends, watching it together. But they no, covered you don't it on live react to that. Yeah. That's that's just mainly awards and stuff. It's not. There's no trailers or anything at all. Yeah. Stance breaking. Okay. Some attacks may break an enemy's stance. Like that? Like this stance, bro. Oh. Oh, oh. I am interested, Bear, because there's a part of me, because I've been playing co op with Andy, I might re roll and go magic build. I oh. currently started with a vagabond like you. I'm now two handing a sword. I won't say which, um, but I'm two handing a sword. I'm a lighter build than Andy. Andy has gone heavy on the sword sides. I'm a lighter build on my side. Mm. But, uh, oh, John, where they did. Right, here we go. Here we uh, go. They did during uh, Kind of Funny Games Daily. Ba our blessing kind of went over some of the award winners. I'll go over the oh, Xbox award fuck. winners on XCast today. No, but, stop drinking uh, they shit. They did a little, a little bit on uh, Games Daily today. You're right. They, nothing massive, though. But they definitely talked about it on Games Daily today. Oh, look at that. Oh, you're dominating this guy. You're dominating this guy. Oh, look at that! Mm, nice job. But I'm interested in going a magic build, pair. I think I might go mm. magic because I'm playing co-op. Because I'm playing co-op, I'm like, ooh, yeah, what if I go magic, dominate through the whole entire game, so now I have this nasty magic build that when I play by myself or with other people, I can show off and be like, yo, look how dope I am. I chose magic. And they'd be like, say what, Mike? You beat the game with magic? And I'll be like, yeah, I beat the game. And then they're gonna be like, but you played a co-op. And be like, yeah, but I still have this dope build though. I got this dope build, everybody. Oh shit, we're up here now. So what I've always appreciated about uh, the Souls games is like just how interconnected everything feels. It's kind of like the, you know, um, God of War earlier, where it all felt like mm -hmm. interconnected. All connected. Uh-huh. All connected. All right. We got a new um, thingamajig. What happens when I touch a bloodstain? So you will get a phantom popping up, and it will show you how they died. Mm. Yeah, that's not working right now. I don't think. Am I really supposed to just go back here? Is this I it? mean, is that not a doorway? What's up? Where are you? I'm back at the like the beginning, right? There's this guy in the chair, and he's like, "Oh, jump down uh -huh, there." Uh -huh. So maybe, yeah, maybe we just go through here now. Uh -huh. so open up that doors. Open up that doors. Oh, there we go. There we go. Could I have just gone through the door? Dang! From the beginning. Ah, uh, yes. Because what you just did was the tutorial. Oh, yeah, yeah. Shit. So he's like, no wonder hey, I felt really you can good either go it. this way or that way. And uh, yeah, I just skipped all of what you just did right there. Gotcha, gotcha. Because he was like, yo, if you want to learn, go that way. If you don't, you just keep it moving. Gotcha. I, like, I do. I do. Um, flasks. Increase amount replenished by flask. Allocate flask charges. I have no idea what the fuck any of this means. So, two things. Uh, there's the upgrade, which is you add an extra flask to your waist, we'll call it. So you have mm. so you have three right now. You're going to get a certain item that will allow you to get four, and then five, right? That currency. And then allocate flask. Now you can find the balance. Health potions compared to magic potions. Oh, so you can put one or the other. And so depending on your okay. build, maybe you go no magic because you're not doing anything. Or maybe yeah. you do a bunch and you go over there. You know what I mean? Does fl do flasks replenish when you go to the 
these light Bonfires, things. Bonfires, a.k.a. the sites of grace. Yes, okay. they do. Okay. Uh-huh. Okay. Completely replenished when you sit down Increasing and rest that. at them. Okay. They like also it. have done a really good job since it's a big open world. They've encouraged you to stay out longer. So there are certain moments throughout the game in your open world, like gameplay itself, that will replenish your flask for you, making it so you don't have to run back to a site of grace, which is kind of cool. And there's different ways about getting those. So awesome. we've got a tarnished uh, wizened finger. So do uh -huh. I have to eat this like in Jujutsu Kaisen? Like the man eats mm. the, the no, finger no, and he's no, got no, a demon no. inside of him? Okay. You just keep it strapped to your waist. You're going to take that finger, shove it into a bag full of chalk, and then you're going to write your name in chalk on the ground. And then you can either leave messages or your friends will come join you. There's a stone sword key. What does that do? Oh, does that open up this fog over here, I imagine? Uh, but that area looks scary. I feel like I'm gonna like fight a boss over there. I don't think I want to do that yet. I'm gonna go over here and see what this guy's got. Pillage remains. All right, all right. Yeah, more fingers. A lot of fingers in this game. It's all about fingers. fingers. You say we don't eat them at all. No, no, don't eat them. Don't eat them. You okay. shove them in your bag of chalk. You write it out. Write it out. Try Another one. You wave it. You wave it. And then your friends come or your friends leave. How do I fucking what? What do I? The message is there, so I can't. Isn't it? Wouldn't it be triangle to to use the item? It would be triangle, and if there was a usable item, they would give you the option to toggle on and off. So uh, you do not have to use it because this is an elevator bear. So the bear, the elevator is currently down. Which is the button. So if, say you were to come oh, up. Oh, shit. So see how it goes up without uh, you? Yeah, 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 now yeah. you can okay. use the lever. Okay. When okay. it goes up. Yep. Mm -hmm. yeah, we mm -hmm. got to wait for mm -hmm. it to go up now. Oh, man. That's going That's going real up. All right. Uh, oh, I see you. See? I see you. Yep. Got it. Got it. Horrible. I did see that news. We were going to do some investigating. I'll do some investigating this weekend. But, you know. Hank the Tank will always live on in our hearts, no matter if it's one bear or three bears underneath God, one trench I love coat. it. <laughs> Is Barrett a Soulsborne version? I'm not. <clears throat> I've, uh... He's not. He's not. He's I've been played, like, that. ten hours of... Maybe not even of Demon Souls uh, remake. Mm. Mm. I remember playing Bloodborne for a little bit. I'm terrible at both. I'm, I'm terrible at all of the Souls games, but... Uh, mm. I also previewed Sekiro. And that was back when, like, no one at Kind of Funny really cared about Souls. And so that was, like, in the first couple of months that I worked at Kind of Funny. Mm -hmm. Or Tim was like, hey, no one wants to go to this preview event down in L.A. Do you want to go preview, uh, um, a Souls game? And I was like, I guess. And so I did. <clears throat> and I came back and I was like, it's difficult, but a different type of difficult. And it'll probably be a Game of the Year contender. And I was right. Whoa, this is crazy. <clears throat> Look at how big this is. Look at all those trees. Wha Let's do the Andy Cortez voice. You ready? <clears throat> Welcome to the world of Elden Ring. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I gotta do like the cinematic. Vast, majestic, legendary, and also punishing. You will explore this incredible handcrafted world by George R. R. Martin and from software. Good luck, young tarnished. Something like that. Something close. So, you yeah, know, I got the, I got the like cinematic that. kind of like, uh, Something you know, close. like, um, fuck, I forget what the, the let Andy called. know that Mike and Barrett can do it too. You know what <laughs> I mean? We can do it too. Oh, there's a person that I can talk to over here. All right. All right. And so map. the cool one, you got a big map, right? Barrett? So you got this cool map. And so you're probably saying to yourself, Mike, there's a massive world. Where the hell am I supposed to go? You'll see that little. I don't want to call it sperm, but like a little sperm <laughs> shot, right? But if you back out, you'll see it glowing off of the uh, site of the grace. Distance. And that will tell you where to go. Because uh, yeah, you see it over your oh, shoulder. You yeah, can yeah. follow that area. Now, it doesn't stay. It's not a rainbow, right? It ends right there. But you can at least know kind of the guidance of where okay, you're supposed okay. to go. Yes. Tarnished, are we? Come Very tarnished. Between for the mm -hmm. Elden mm -hmm. Ring. So I didn't even know that this was like you're gonna try to be the Elden Lord, and apparently there's a man who eats his uh, who eats poop. They call him the what was it the in the opening credit <laughs> or the opening cutscene. He's like the um the dung, the dung eater. eater, the dung oh, eater. Okay, okay. They're like yeah, this guy eats poop and no one likes him. I don't know if I've met the dung eater, or maybe I'm just not reading his name. We'll find out. 
It was in like the open, you know, like with all like the kind of like painting, uh, kind of okay, like okay. opening cutscene that is where you see him. The fuck is this thing? This summoning just, pools. Yeah, summoning pool. Okay. All right, all right. I like it. So is that where I summon like uh, NPCs to fight alongside me, or if uh, NPCs are just easy to find friends. other jabronis? Yeah. yeah, yeah. What's going on up here? Are these enemies? Yeah, they are. Oh shit. Cool, no, stop uh, eating it or stop drinking <laughs> the fucking flasks. God damn it. That's what happens when I go from one open world game to another. I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna get you. No! Oh, oh damn it. Bear tried to kill those eagles, y'all. They did not like that. They, uh, they were just like, all right, fuck off. Ooh, who is that? Smart fella. Just got his PS5 delivered yesterday. Oh, shit. Can't wait to deep. Can't wait to dive into this. Well, awesome. Have some fun with your PlayStation 5. Barrett, should I get the cool colorway PS5 side panels? You know, I like the white. I think the white looks cool. But, like, it, you know, because they don't have that many colors. This isn't, like, black, red, and maybe purple, right? Or do they have more colors? They, it, it was, like, black, red, purple, pink, and blue. So oh, you could okay, do the pink more. and okay. blue mixed up. And do the kind of funny kinda colors. Dope. Okay, you know? actually, that's kind of dope. Okay, okay, okay. All right, I'm gonna try to fight this man. It's probably not gonna go well. Man on a horse. Man on a horse. I'm gonna sneak up to. It. I'm gonna sneak up uh, and try to backstab him. Oh, oh. yeah. This is not going. This is not gonna go well. The tree Woo! sentinel with the boss. Right off the no! jump. Oh, oh, shit. He immediately came down upon you. Ooh, purple looks good. I like purple. Uh-oh. There you go. There you go. Use your work. Now work on it. Now work it. Yeah, yeah. I got to remember I'm not great with the... Oh, oh shit. Oh, you he really wore me. No, god damn it. Oh, no, bro. <laughs> oh, yep. Yeah, there we go. The horse gave me a little the first side you died. The first one. you died. Uh, Cyber State, thank you so much for the Prime Gaming <laughs> Sub. And remember, with your Prime Gaming Sub or your Tier 1 through Tier 3 Sub, gets you ad-free viewing because it's the top of the hour, and I'm going to hit you with a block of Twitch ads. But if you're subscribed, you don't have to miss out on the fun of Barrett jumping into Elden Ring with all of you. This is literally the first moments of the game. But if you aren't subscribed, Think about subscribing. You can help support us here at Kind of Funny. You can help fill up that bar for us to go for the full extra hour. But as of right now, we'll be the top of the hour when we return after these ads. We'll have 45 minutes on the clock. If we fill up the bar, we can go for the full extra hour. We can add on to the monthly goals where I will play Zelda Breath of the Wild with you. So think about supporting, whether you're gifting subs, dropping bits, or having fun with all of your friends. You can do that. And guess what? Here we go. All right. I went back so I could refill my, uh... Yeah, I could refill my flasks because I accidentally fucking drank another health potion. Yeah, you're gonna have to get a little tighter with that little... I gotta, little I gotta get that, used to it. I gotta that. get used to it. Okay. Big that's... fan of this game with the back paddles. Of course, we talk oh. about that on the Xbox side of things using your Xbox Elite controller. Really, I actually love all games using the back paddles. That's my move now. That's my move. All right, I'm getting my lost runes. There we Bag go. of Soup says, is co-op good in this game? Bag of Soup, I've played 10 full hours of co-op. I've only played co-op. It's absolutely great. Is there a way to remap controls, Mikey? Yes, there is. Yes, mm -hmm. there is. I'm trying to decide if it's worth it or if I just need to get used to it, you know? So I remapped. The only things I truly remapped was block and parry. Because I am a sword and board, and I like blocking more than parrying in this Dark Souls game compared to Sekiro, I put block on the R1 or L1 up here, and I put parry on L2. It just felt a little more natural. Was that not the... Because that, that was the default for me, was uh, block L1, parry L2. Really? No, I had uh, I had it vice versa. Oh, interesting. Or maybe it was, and maybe I was just super God. out of it. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> Uh, a lot man. of, all right, lot all right, of squares, hold on, lot hold of squares on. on that one. We got to figure out like the square mm -hmm. situation here. Uh, I don't know if this was the if that mm. was the setting I had. All right, hold on. 
button settings. All right. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. <sighs> See, yeah, I think I want to switch this. Wait, what? No. Hold on. You go here. Well, he. You know what? Anthro metal. I'm going to tell you when you read the when you read those button mappings, it doesn't say block or parry. They have different words for it. Okay, so my bad, <laughs> my bad. All right, we're gonna go fight this thing. Nailed it. That made me feel good. That made me feel good. There you go. You killed at. a helpless sheep. No. <laughs> and then you drank. Then you drank on top of him, bro. You can't be doing that. <laughs> Holy shit. Barrett's biggest downfall. <laughs> he just controlling himself from just drinking all the flasks before he actually needs them. All right. I'm going to sneak up on this man. People are saying victory juice, though, so you did a good job. Victory a juice, sass, yeah. little Assassin's Creed type moment for you. You're good at this. You got this. Yeah, here we go. Here we go. Yeah, there we go. Not bad, not bad. I like it. Next one, lock onto him. Get a little bit tighter right there up on his backside, and you'll get that full-on backstab. The actual animation. backstab? All right, yeah, all you're right. just a little far away. You're like a step or two away. Okay. There's more of them over here off the beaten path. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I like it. Do I need to be the, on the lock-on to be able to do the backstab as well? No, but uh, it's just a okay, okay. It's just a little more. Helpful. <laughs> it's a little more helpful. That's all. A little okay. More oh no, he saw me. It's okay. It's okay. We're just practicing here. We're learning. Right, We're I finally, learning the buttons. I, no, what? What? There you go. You're taunting on him. You're taunting on him. I wanted to pillage him. The I prefer the there tactical crouch, but it's also acceptable to do the taunt. Okay. All right, we're slowly getting used to using square to pick up things. Mm -hmm, All right, mm -hmm. we're getting some resin. I'm excited. Resin's always yeah, good. Yeah. Some of that resin. So those glowing leaves are the things you'll use for co-op as well. So that's nice. You got a little glowing skull there you can beat down. Give that a little swipe. Oh, shit. What the fuck? He just kicked it. He's not actually moving. Okay. I Let's thought it was moving on its own. Swipe. Yeah. Hey, it's got oh, a, maybe it's got an something. item in there. Maybe it's got an item because it's glowing. That skull. He doesn't seem to be moving at all, so I want to be like right up on him. Nope. Okay. A little bit closer. Close. Even closer. Wow. I'm so used to like it gonna be it, like they're gonna be able to detect me in like just a second. Mm. Nah, this Jabroni, he don't know. He's half dead. He don't know any better. Oh, R1 without moving might also be helpful. No moving. Mm. Mm. Kind of like the classic uh, Metal Gear thing. There we go. There you go. There we nailed now it. We're on it. Now we're nailed on it, it, folks. We're pressing buttons here. We're pressing the right buttons, you we're know? We're pressing buttons and we're making the video game do things. That's all you could ask for in a video game. I want to go find that skull because that skull seems cool. Yeah, get, it's back get in that, that bush. Skull. Oh, here we go. Here. Uh, yep. And then give it a little hack. There you go. Look, a night him. A golden rune. All right. Hey, hey now. Liddy, Liddy. Drink to that, the Twitch chat says. Why don't you burn another flask? Why, don't you do, why not? Why not? <laughs> Throw one up. Throw one down. Oh, we're coming. Welcome to your first enemy encampment. A number of gods will be surveying the area. You'll have to sneak in and maybe find the treasures that lay ahead. Just doing the Bag of soup. Hand. Thank you for paying, paying that, paying forward and gifting out a tier one sub. Right there. Thank you to Bag of Soup. And we're getting closer right now. Remember, that bar is super low. If we fill it up all the way, we'll go for the full extra hour. We're in overtime. We have 45 minutes on the clock. We can make it an extra hour so far. And we'll work towards our monthly goals, which, of course, uh, if y'all vibe with the idea. Oh, look at you changing up weapons now, bro. You're insane. Did you mean to do that? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> like, oh, man, you came out of nowhere, bro. There we go. There we go. 
Oh, because I, 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 when I fought the first dude who had like the sh the big shield and stuff, I was like, uh, oh well, the uh, regular sword doesn't really like do much against him, you know. It's a cool part about this game. You find the stuff that you like. I might I might start doing magic in this game, just so everybody knows. I might just switch completely on my build to full magic. I'm thinking about doing it. Okay. Mike, we need y'all to get back into later daters. Yeah, I know. We got to work on my voice acting because I have oh one voice that I just <laughs> That changed. old lady voice, right? <laughs> yeah, exactly. That old lady that smoked too much pot voice. You know what I mean? That's, that's where I'm at. Uncle Death, I'm going to stick around with it. I don't know if Greg will stick with me, but uh, my weekend plans are to get back into Destiny 2, complete the campaign, and then we will reassess and talk from there of like... Oh, what's shit! Oh! <laughs> oh my God, he came out of nowhere! Out of nowhere, this man. Oh, yeah, right back at him. He right says. back at you, you buddy. You broke his guard right there. You slapped that guy so hard, you broke his guard. Holy shit, that was awesome. Yeah, totally unexpected. I did not expect to, to turn that guy around. I man. know. Just out of nowhere, too, because I snuck in from this way. Like, he was, like, hanging out over maybe in this bush or some shit. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. They're out there, bro. You got to be careful, dude. You're in the, you're in an enemy encampment. You never know where they could be. Yeah, yeah. I don't know where any of these two bonus could be. All right. All of the... All of the sperm is pointing me to this uh, this direction. Oh, here. yes. Maybe there's a uh, a new site of grace you could go to. Maybe yeah. refill your flasks as well on the site of yeah, grace. But then, like, the enemies uh, come back, right? Mm -hmm. right. Uh, the enemies do come back. Do come back. Yep. Uh-huh. 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 Barrett, how's the game feel on PS5? I've been hearing about some frame rate issues. I think maybe in our 30 minutes of playing this so far, like, I've noticed, like, one hiccup or two. Okay. But nothing okay, okay. nothing where it was like, oh fuck, I gotta I gotta play this on a different platform, you know. Mm, but also we mm, I don't think mm. we've gotten to anything super intensive yet. Oh shit, we mm. got a cutscene. Yeah. yeah, my Xbox version didn't have massive issues at all. I enjoyed the Xbox version. Oh shit, what's going on here? No, oh, it's from the cutscene. Or from the, the trailers. Greetings. Yep. This weird little Melina, child. From beyond the fog. Beyond the fog. I am Melina. Oh, damn. I offer you an accord. Eyes all fucked up. She's got a cool tattoo yeah. on it, though. Get a little, little Lord dump. Now I've been picking up fingers, though. I don't want to eat them. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but now you need to know about the finger maiden, bro. Offering guidance and aid to the tarnished. The tack gave her an infection. <laughs> Our maiden must. I can play the role of maiden. Turning wounds into strength. Oh, Iron Fist looks really cool in see Oh, okay, mm, looks okay, cool. okay. You need only take me with you. All well, this finger talk got uh, got me wanting some chicken fingers. Ooh. I should accept this, right? Yes. Yeah, accept that. Accept that. She's offering you help. Okay. Okay. There's going to be some crazy jabronis out there who, like, refuse your help, though, and, like, don't level up at all in this game, I assume. I just murder anyone in my path that goes against me and my will. <laughs> okay? If anybody goes across the path, I will murder them. Will Torrent get me some, like, cool PS2 games and shit? Some free music. Uh, someone was asking about. Yeah, this game seems uh, to be kind of finger heavy. I, I imagine that was George R. R. Martin's doing. Oh, you think so? You think he was the one writing about the fingers? That was yeah, him. Yeah, that was. He was okay, like, "Hey, was fingers," and then left. 
He's like, that's all I got. He's like, this is what I wanted here. Yeah. And they're like, all right, cool. All right, let's see. How do I know? What, what's the button again, Barry? You told me the last time. How do I see my pre-order for the Steam Deck? There it is. There it is. It's my good expected app. order availability will be after Q2 2022. Okay. 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 I reserved it on Friday, July 16th, back in 2021. I will slowly await my Steam Deck. So, like, how many points do I have to spend here? That's my question. Or do, is that even, like, a thing? Uh, what are you talking about? Oh, so this is your stat bar right. right here. And so you will upgrade your stats off of the runes held, a.k.a. souls, in previous games. You can see okay. the runes up on top, right? So to uh, get one level up, you need 811, 811. runes okay. to okay. level up your strength up one so now you need to make the choice here man the cool part about this game is any character you choose it doesn't matter okay because you can make your character however you want later on so now you look at vigor is of course health yeah. mind is mana then you go into endurance strength dexterity intelligence and faith are going to be what you use to level up your magic arcane i don't like arcane at all arcane is like you're finding items out in the world chances which i think is mm. dumb i don't like that and so, for me, I'm going to reset my build just so everybody knows. I'm going Intelligence and Faith because I want to do Magic. Dexterity will help you with, like, Katanas and, like, Fast Blades yeah, and yeah. or the Bow. And, of course, Strength is going to be your big heavy weapons there. Yeah. So, it depends on how you go. Defense. Sword and Board. Yeah, Arcane Luck. Yeah, that's a good call, 8-Bit Luis. That's, a, that's a, either way to say that is right. I kind of like the HP up. I feel like HP up at the uh, HP beginning. up is always a, a always a positive, yeah, always a positive. Yeah. I like it. I like it. You can never go wrong with HP up. You like to see that health bar get bigger and bigger every time you play his rights. All right, we'll leave. We'll leave for now. Oh shit! You dismount by using the whistle again. So how do I use the? Okay, shit. Use item and pouch. Okay. No! <laughs> just burning flash. Positive, you're so close. Just sit yeah, down. Yeah, I, 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 and I haven't fought. Uh, Maybe anybody. we just changed that button. You know what I mean? We meant. <laughs> but that's the problem. That I changed <laughs> it. <laughs> I changed it already. Um. How do I get over there? Oh shit. Okay, so this is two handed. Two handed, yep. Uh -huh. I like two handed. That. So you go Andy taught me to go two handed against the big bosses because you're never mm. you're not really blocking their incredible strikes at you, you know? Right. You can, but like you're not really. So you can go two handed against them. These smaller dudes, you'll probably want to go sword and board to parry and or block them. Right. Oh, wow. Look at that. Look at you. Look at that. Look at you, Hot. Bear. Now, do oh, me a favor. Turn around. Look at this chariot thing. Uh, jump right on the back of that and step up to those candles. A little bit of a chest action right there on the back of this chariot. Oh, wow. So now you know if you see those, look for the chest. Look for the chest. I got a long, long sworn's great sword. All right. Ooh. All right. Okay. I'm going to go hide okay. in a bush because I think... The dog walker is here, so give me Oh, the just dog a walker is here. Uh, thank you to AdSmith85 for the Prime Gaming sub for 41 months, finishing a 13 hour workday with the kind of funny best friends. Hey, ain't nothing better than that. Thank you so much for your hard work out there. Way to kick butt on your big shift. Let's kick your feet up. Let's play some video games. Let's have some fun and enjoy the start of the weekend. And if it's not your weekend, drink some OJ. Get some rest and relax with us either way. So you can go back to work feeling good right now. Yeah, that's the question, Jay to the Jay to the Vice, is when will I get this handheld? It says Q2. What is Q2 to Steam? I don't know. I don't know what Q2 is, you know what I mean? So we'll find out together. Shout out to Adam Shenanigans for the Prime Gaming Stuff for 21 months. It says Friday Woo. We're getting close, Twitch chat. Remember, if we fill up this bar all the way, we'll go for the extra hour right now with the corner of my, my eye. We have 30 minutes left on this stream. 30 minutes left, or we make it the full extra hour 
right now. Let's go for it, y'all. Q2, April, and June. That's what I thought, too. Uh, just another mic. That's how I took it as well. Um, but I don't know. You know what I mean? I don't know. I'm hoping so. I'm hoping so. Uh, uh, uh. Man, like you're still getting network airs? Man, like I think you're going to have to unplug your router, plug it back in. Okay, because I'm not getting network airs. So here's what I need you to do. Unplug it, blow in it, plug it back in. If it doesn't work, unplug it again. Unplug it again. Uh, shout out to Na Naughty Biscotti for the gifted two subs. Thanks, Naughty Biscotti, for continuing to help push this bar up right now. Let's keep it going, y'all. Remember, the word of the day. Impact. Leaving a positive impact on somebody's life today or this weekend. I want you to smile at somebody. Give somebody a compliment. Tell them that you care, that you're thinking about them, that they've left a positive impact on your life. And let them know that you want to be there for them. So impact is the word of the day and into the weekend. Think about it. Leaving a positive impact on somebody around you's life. All right. Oh, man, it's, oh, you're too good to me. Thank you, Soft X. I'm close. I'm deciding on what I'm doing with this beard. You know, if you listen to the Kind of Funny podcast, you probably heard Tim talk about dyeing his beard. And there was going to be a challenge at Throwdown is we were going to play Mario Party and Loser would have to shave their beard. And I was going to be like, yo, I'm willing to shave mine because I just, it's just patchy. I really like the beard. I enjoy the beard going from baby's, baby face Mike, but I just hate the patches. I just can't, I just can't do it. I can't grow a good one, y'all. And so it's like, what do you got to do? What are you going to do? Big or bad wolf girl, 3124. Thank you, bad wolf girl, for the gifted tier one sub as well on a Friday. Well, thank you for paying it forward right there after your gifted sub for Naughty Biscotti. Oh, don't forget Twitch chat as well. Uh, we are talking about Xbox Game Pass family plan. What would it look like? What would you want out of that on today's Kind of Funny X Cast? So if you have some thoughts regarding a Game Pass family plan that you would like to see, maybe inspired by others, or what you'd want on the console side of things, let me know in chat. I'll put it over there. I'll write it down for my notes because Paris brought it up last week, and uh, we're going to have a fun conversation. It's a nice, easy little one talking about it. Yeah, bro, I got Don't a turn strong... Don't turn around. Don't turn around. ...poisonous Ethiopian caterpillar on my upper lip right there. Sorry. God damn it! <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit. Alright, alright. We snuck up on that jabroni. There's another jabroni, like, over here. Mm -hmm. And you notice how it just went to nighttime, too, bro, bro? Oh, yeah. That day and night cycle going on? What's the ideal day and night cycle for you, Barrett? Is it 12 like and 12? Long? Is it 16 and 8? Yeah, like how how long and like what's what's the percentage that you want? I want... Mm, that's a good question. That's a really good question. You know what I mean? Because I prefer more day than night. So like I'm a 16 oh, fuck. type guy. Oh, that guy saw you. Yep. Yes, he did. Oh, somehow the other guy didn't get alerted though, you know? Now, for Breezy, you say shared DLC for all family accounts will be lit. So are you saying that, like, say <clears throat> I buy Destiny 2, the Witch Queen, you're in my family plan. Now you get the DLC as well. Is that what you want? Is that what you mean by that? That's so interesting. It's essentially thing. like what Nintendo so does. One, oh, really? Is that what they do on no. Nintendo? I, I don't so, say like, anything. I, I, I have anything. the family plan with, my, uh, with Alyssa, right? And uh -huh. so because I got the family plan, she gets the Animal Crossing DLC. Bang. But, like, did you buy the Animal Crossing or is that, like, a freebie? That's a freebie along with the, the family plan. Okay, but I'm just saying, now, let's say if you bought it. Say Animal Crossing DLC was $15. If okay. you bought that, would it be shared with Alyssa? With, uh, Alyssa? On you Nintendo? Know what I mean? No. Yeah, see, now that's a different one, you know yeah. what I mean? Let's yeah, yeah, let's yeah. talk about that, you know? It's like, what if what if it was a paid thing? It's Let's just say it's $30 for fun. Does everybody in the family plan get that? And w with a one purchase of $30 seems... Seems kind of wild right there. Seems kind of wild. Flail? Whatever the fuck that is? All right. Dude, those are those cool ones with the stick with the ball on the string. Yeah. Dude, I like those. 
All right, those so, seem like I would hit myself in the head with one of yeah, those. Yeah, a hundred percent. Um, I'm gonna go, Mikey. Sixty percent day, forty percent night. I think 60% that's a good. Sixty percent day, forty percent night. Okay, so you're very close to the fifty-fifty. Yeah, very close. Okay, and now what's the time? Eight minutes. You know, eight minutes. Eight minutes. Is it twelve? Twelve? Like what? What kind of minutes are we talking? You know what I mean? That's what that's minutes? where I run into the the problem there of like. What do I prefer in that situation? I don't really know if I have, like, a straight-up answer. Hold on. I'm going to sneak up on this dude, and I'm just making sure that there's no other jabronis uh, hanging out. And there probably is. Uh, oh, yeah. See? So, slightly, slightly Sausage brings up this one. I'm sharing Witch Queen DLC with my shun. As long as each other set the home Xbox to the other persons, you can share anything, including Game Pass and oh, the Xboxes. Is. Now that's the workaround. That's the unofficial Xbox doesn't promote that, but it is the workaround type thing. Mm. We know that, and I'm gonna make that clear to the comments because I know the comments will roast us on this podcast right. if I don't. But I'm uh, we're talking about a straight up you uh, you can avoid <clears throat> that by not doing that. We'll make it a little more streamlined than doing all of that. What would you want? And so shared DLC. That's interesting. That's interesting. What's going on with these fucking these? These Those bats, are bats over, bro. Yeah. Those are bats, dude. They're oh, just they weren't here earlier, flock, were dude. they? They might be nighttime. Uh, nighttime only. Nighttime enemies. things. Nighttime yeah. things. Nighttime things. That's cool. I love that. Yeah, exactly. Slightly sausage because now you both can only do that in the two Xboxes. Say we're in a, like an actual like family home, and there's four of us with three different Xboxes. You know what I mean? Or more PC as well. Cloud gaming. How do we get it all to link up perfectly? Mm-hmm. Cause there's a lot to it, a lot to it. Nighttime Pokemon. Just clearing out this thing. Ooh, clearing out this encampment, y'all. <clears throat> Slowly but surely. I imagine mm -hmm. that. Yeah, that big dude looks tough down there. Oh yeah, there you go. That guy had a that horn so too. He was probably gonna call everybody if I fought him. He, d you know what, Barrett? He does do that. So good call, bro, bro. He does. Do that. <laughs> I'm a gamer. You I know how to play Souls you, games. You thought I had a horn strapped to his hip. You did. You said no, 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 yep. no, no, no. Oh shit! There's this dude. Now, too. Bear, we have about 20, 25 minutes left on the stream by my. I got, I got thirty on my. On, oh, on my thirty report. minutes. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Uh, then I'm gonna at twenty minutes. I'm gonna push you somewhere. So keep doing your okay. thing. I'm gonna make you do something. I'll make you go into one of the optional dungeons Ooh. just so we can see you collide with like. A mini boss, we'll yeah. call it, but all a right, boss like right. situation. Map ahead. Ooh, map ahead. Oh shit, okay. Map found. All right, I like it. I'm into it. So if I open up, oh shit, yeah, there you go. Oh, this isn't even like the full, like, we're not even in the open world, open world yet. Interesting. Very interesting. Uh, yeah, you are in the first part of the open world. Stormgate. Right? Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. Should I go over to Storm uh, Stormgate? Should we start heading our way over there? Uh, Making our way no. downtown? No. Here's what I want you to do. See, so to your right, towards like the gate behind you, uh, you see a cliffside. That cliffside on the left-hand side, I want you to follow that and wrap that around. Okay. Stay on the base level, but follow the left-hand side of that cliff. And wrap <clears> it around. <throat> We're going to go find a little mini dungeon. All righty. Let's go do it. <clears throat> I'm gonna go to the. I'm gonna go to rest this up, little. Call, yeah. Rest up. Rest up. I probably accidentally drank a potion at some point. Actually, um, when you stand up, look at your map. I wonder if it shows. I'm forgetting uh, if it shows. It might show on your map uh, where we're gonna go here in a second. Do I have enough? Oh, dude, I have enough fucking have enough rooms souls. to level up here. Souls. So I did. I did HP at first. Let's do. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, let's do endurance or no? Uh. Oh, oh! Endurance or strength, maybe for more damage, of course, yeah, on your weapons. Strength. I like that. That was a good decision. Yeah, those are going to be like your main three there. If you're going sword and board, or like a, a you know that. Uh, so bring up your map really quick. Uh, no, it doesn't show it. Okay, cool. So yeah, we're so going like to go pretty much here. where you're pointing. Yeah, I want to go there. Okay. And you'll see it if you follow this. You're going to see a little. Little cave open up. Let's okay. give a big shout out to Huggy right there. Huggy with the five gifted tier one subs and then the five star man. The tier one sub for 16 months. Need everyone to stop making this look so great. I gotta finish Horizon 
before I jump into this or or five star man, you find the balance. OK, then you just start juggling two games at once. You're or, drinking flask when you weren't supposed to. Yeah. Or you play God of War. OG. Or, or you go to PlayStation now, play God of War instead. <laughs> <laughs> right, I got this jabroni at uh, looking looking for something over here. Oh, is it go. is it this ooh, thing right here? Ooh, is there something in there? Uh oh, he's looking for me now. I think. Oh no no no! He don't want it. He don't want it. <sighs> there we go. Oh. It feels like I'm making so much noise. Like I feel like the guy uh, walking over there should have heard me. You know. Mm. No, no, not that, not that silent strike. Got a shroom. All right, all right. Okay, here we go. Groveside Cave. Welcome to the Groveside Cave. All right, cave. so I'm, am I going to be properly leveled for this, or is this going to kick uh, off Yes, butt? this is an early okay. optional dungeon, early right. optional dungeon. You will be able to fight this. Of course, we will collide with the boss fight, but, so it will be tough, but you are here. I gotta remember the buttons. Oh shit, we got some wolves. Ooh. Oh fuck. Wolves. Right, Anything that glows, boss? always make sure to pick up all the items you can, Twitch chat. Just so you all know, that's a good little fact right there. Just pick things up. Pick things up. Now, if I jump down here, are they gonna be able to hear me? Probably, right? Oh. Uh, they will probably see you. I think if you. Go up into the left. You can get a nice jump slash on him if you wanted to. Mm, okay. But if you jump into that pit, you're going to awaken the wolves. Oh, shit. Sure. Oh, that wolf oh, shit. has seen you. Okay, yep. Okay, the other ones have not. So you, you, you successfully kited out the one, which is good. Oh, oh look yeah, at that, murder. dude. Look at that. Even killed wolf. We're gamers. Yep, right. yep, yep, yep. Right. Now it's just, oh, shit. Oh, no, he's looking big for big mama yep. wolf. Big mama wolf. Oh, shit. Double wolf. There you go. Play your game. Play your game. Make him play your game. Oh, it fell. Didn't take any oh, fall damage, oh, though. Fall. I don't like that. No, no, that's a small fall. That's a small, that's a tiny fall, tiny fall. This game as well, actually pretty nice on the fall damage. There mm. will be a certain point you hit some, but you're, you'll be surprised. You can fall from much higher height than you would normally assume would take fall damage. All right, come on, mama. Come on, mama. Mm -hmm. Big wolf murdered. Ooh, ooh. Oh! I forgot about go. the stamina in it there as well. Go. Oh, yeah. Uh huh, uh huh, uh huh. There you there go, go, there you go. There more go. coming, more coming. All right, well, he felt like a big, dumb idiot. Mm -hmm. All right, there we go, there we go. Come on. Oh, Fuck nice. yeah, dude. With the block and then counterattack. I love that move. move right yeah, Holy you, shit. If you hear that little ding a ling, that means yo, swipe back at him right there. Oh, this guy didn't didn't hear any of the fighting going on. Oh, uh, shit. He didn't hear nothing, but he smells you. Oh, do they smell me? Uh, th I mean, I, I have to assume that's why he stood up you a crowd, so, you know. But he's walking, walking back he and forth. He don't vibe. He, he, like he don't see it. He don't see it. Yeah, he probably just walks back and forth, right? He's probably he's just like got up. a walk pattern. Oh. Oh, yeah, there matter. you go. Doesn't there matter. you go. So is, the, is this mini boss just going to be a really giant wolf? I imagine. So. I don't know what will be at the end of this cave. Don't could do it be that a giant to me, wolf? Mike. Could don't it be something else? I don't know that. what it could be. <laughs> All right, we. we I will used, say these. Yeah, tell me. We used the right button to pick up the crack yep. spot. Uh huh. You picked up the right one. You have not used any uh, potions yet, which is very good where you want to be. I will say these first couple of bosses you see in these early optional ones are actually all very, very cool. They did a great job on a lot of them. Nice. Oh, shit. Is it in here? Yeah. That looks like it's it. Acquired materials. Yeah, that looks that looks like it's going to be the boss right there. I could be wrong, though. Let's go this way, then. Taking a walk. On a fun new area. Oh, shit. There's another wolf. Because we don't have a torch. <laughs> Oh shit, there were several. There were several. Okay. Ooh. Nice. Alright. 
Alright, alright, alright. Glowstone. Got some glowstone. Glowstone. Okay. I don't know what that means, but I like it. Mm. Gold rune. Glowstone. Silver firefly. Mm -hmm. Gotta get that moss, that cave moss. Okay, now seems like a good time to maybe use a potion. Just to get in here at a full a full mm. health, you know? Maybe, maybe, maybe. Or how much health does the does the potion uh fill up, Mikey? Most of the health. I would say more of the, more than that. So like what you have right now, you're filling up more than that for sure. Okay. Okay. I think you're then filling up about fifty to sixty percent with how small your health right. bar is. I think that's filling up a good chunk of it. Alright, so I forget. Was it I would say we take one hit from the boss, then we drink. But uh, you could also go in there full, fully cocked if you wanted to, because you're at you're at three. You got three. I forget how to double hand. Uh, it's a weird button combo. It's like yeah. L L one or R one, and then Y. I don't know. I don't do it that often. I always forget every time I do it. R one and then one. No, you're, you're writing button. Triangle plus R1. R1 plus triangle. There we go. Okay. L1 plus triangle. L1 plus triangle sounds right. Nope. Okay, okay. That was his health. That was his health. Rayman is just throwing everything out there. L1, R1 triangle. I only switched square and triangle, though. That's all I switched. Okay, you switch things. So it's square in your case. So when you bring up this secondary menu, okay. that's when you press square. Well, I'm pressing square right now. Okay, so normally it would be triangle. So I don't know for you. Oh, there we there go. We there go. we go. There you got to hold uh -huh. square first and then Okay. I was I was holding L1 first. All right. Oh, he's a beast man. I don't like he's that. A beast man. He's a beast man, y'all. Oh, good dodges, good dodges. <clears throat> oh, I, I... oh, oh so no! Cool oh, shit. Oh, this is rough. This is rough. Oh, shit. Oh, ho, ho, ho. he came down. Oh, on no! <laughs> that was this fun. This is the beast, man, bro. Yeah, you right, did a great right. first run. You got to learn his movements. Yeah, you know what yeah, I mean? This yeah. is the game. As Andy likes to call it patient Pete, I like oh, to say, yeah. don't overstay your welcome. Mm. You know, you get your two and then you back up, right? You get your two, you back up. You, you back don't, up. You yeah. want to go for three or four, but you know better. You know what I mean? You yeah. know better. You don't need three or four. So now you have this fun moment here where you could run past all these wolves, but it's going to be a great chase on your butt to try to get to the, like, pass through portal or you kill them all again. I don't think this guy's gonna notice me if I do it this way. But we gotta be careful about this guy. Because mm -hmm. he's got a walk cycle. He's got a walk path. Uh, yep, see? Let him walk, let him walk, let him walk. Yeah, you he's don't see at... shit, dude. Yeah, you I, think he's, you I think he's sniffing you out, shit. bro. I think he's sniffing you out. You think so? You think it's a... Uh, I think, think it's... so, bro. I think the wolves are a little bit different than the normal jabronis. But I could be wrong. But I think he's sniffing you out. Yeah, he is. He turned around. There you go. There you go. Run it out. 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 And touch that wall. Touch that wall. Yes. There we go. All right, so now we're playing the dance with him while also trying to pick back up our dead body for our runes, aka souls. So something to oh, be mindful of. Oh! There you go. You're Gucci. You're Gucci. You're Gucci. There we go. Oh, he don't got it like you got it. Ah! Oh man, that was crazy, bro. That was crazy. Oh, you still you you continue to after that big uh 
God damn. Oh, I keep forgetting wow. to like heal myself too. Yeah, now, is did, this yeah. guy small enough that I feel like I could do the sword and shield? I think you could try it. He is okay. small enough. He is small okay. enough. You could probably try it. I don't know. Some of those strikes are a little overwhelming. It might eat up your whole uh, endurance bar. Yeah. But then all of a sudden you get the like, ah, you know what I mean? Yeah. You're, ah, you're, sta you're staggered out, but you never know. Could be worth it. It could be worth it. Mm -hmm. Could be worth it. He could be worth it. Could He does look parable, maybe, is right. Uh, are we fat rolling? Are you fat rolling right now? I can't tell. I don't know what that means. So that means you're wearing heavy armor and your guy's not quite strong enough for everything. Oh, so he, yeah. he rolls real slow and fat. So what I did was I just took off my t-shirt and my helmet early in the game so I could roll as fast as possible. Oh, shit. And then Andy was like, put a t-shirt on. And I was like, never. Bro. Oh, yeah. Wow. Oh, yeah, he, like, fully. There you go, right, bro. Well, I got my lost runes. There you go, yeah, we want those, we want those. You're Gucci, you're Gucci. Oh! Get Don't out of there. Okay, okay, you're fine, you're fine, you're fine. There you go. Ah! Oh! There you go, read his movements. There you go, good block. <clears throat> Fine. Oh, shit! Oh. Go one to the neck. Quick one to the neck, won't hurt nobody. Hey, Twitch, I have a question for all of you. I was doing some looking yesterday. And it looks like there's like some back and forth, of course, like the big news was Call of Duty was going to take a full year off in 2023, right? The next release, not this year's release, but next year's. But then IGN put up a statement from Activision saying that like, no, we're still planning on releasing all those games. And that's not true. Does anybody know where we actually fell with that? Or are they actually taking a year off? Because the headline says next year's Call of Duty has reportedly been delayed for the following year. But then they say, update, Activision has reached out to IGN with a statement on the reports of 2023's Call of Duty release was being delayed to 2024. Quote, we have an exciting slate of premium and free to play Call of Duty experiences for this year, next year and beyond. Reports of anything otherwise are incorrect. We look forward to sharing more details when the time is right. So it's like, what's the deal? You know what I mean? That's the deal. I don't give a fuck. Did you murder that guy? Yeah, I don't give a Did fuck what the deal guy? is. I, I, I was like, Mike doesn't even know what's happening. I know. Everybody in the chat was like, great timing, Mike. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I did it in three. I feel proud oh, of that. Oh, man, bro. You did it, dude. You did it, bro. Oh, nice that felt shit. Great. That felt great. So now we got to go do another one. You did that way faster than I thought, man. Good stuff. I'm a gamer. I'd be so cuphead. If you, if you want to see what the role is like without the fat roll, Take off your secondary weapon and maybe lose the armor and uh, feel the roll then. Feel how that feels for yourself. So how can I um, see, like, is there like a There's a weight, weight somewhere. There's a weight on your guy somewhere on this screen that you'll see. Equipment load, load, I believe. Oh, okay, yeah, there we go. So what that says medium load. So give it a roll, see if you have see if it's good. I think you might be a little too heavy still. Yeah, it says heavy load. Right. Yeah, take take, that's take 30... that. Hold on. Take off that weird axe is what I would say. Take off the axe. The axe. You have a secondary weapon equipped it up on the tippy top. It's brown, it kind of blends in. Oh, this, uh, the halberd? Uh-huh. Yeah, if you take that off, there you go. Okay, you're still medium load. And then I'd take off the take off the armor. Show your chest, dude. Let him see your chest. Put yeah, the shield back on. Show him your chest. You look great without it. Honestly, I'm going to take off the gauntlets. I feel like they the... say now you're good. They're saying you're good. They're saying you're a good. A medium load? Okay. Yeah, give it a try. Give it a try. Give me a, give me a, give me a, give me a, yep. Oh, yeah, there you go. Yeah. Feel that? Feel that a little bit faster? That feels a little better. 
So, so now we have phone. another one if you want to do it. Yeah, so what we do is um, we go follow this, follow this hilltop again, mm -hmm. but then instead of the left side, let's go to the right hand side and do the same thing where you follow the wall okay. to the right. right. And uh, like there it. should be another one there. It's daytime now. Look at it. Time has passed. So Twitch chat said to me, none can decode that statement. Um, <laughs> okay, I don't know. <laughs> that doesn't help me. That doesn't help me. It just feels like a non-statement kind of thing. Yeah, know, like, so, but, like, everybody was hot on saying that they're going to take the year off. Right. You know what I mean? So the, so that statement to me says, we're not going to take the year off. Sure, we might hit you with the, oh, we've delayed the full-on main game and given you a free-to-play mobile title. But, like, it still does that. You know what I mean? Yeah, someone was like, I didn't I didn't uh, listen, Mike. I was celebrating the boss kill. <laughs> we're not celebrating the boss, okay? We're goddamn talking about something. Focus. Wait for it on XCast, Mike. Jesus. <laughs> I need your help, people. <laughs> um, let's go, like, ooh. Yeah, let's go, like, Endurance. I like that. And the stamina goes up a little bit. Yeah, I like that. I like that decision. That was a good decision. I like that. I like that. I like that. I like that. We're killing things. Let's fill up this bar, Twitch chat. We are so no! close <laughs> to filling up today's bar. Just like you can fill up Barrett's um, bottles of juice as he <laughs> continues to drink them, y'all. I love my juice, Mike. We can fill up this bar, keeping it going for another extra 15 minutes and filling it up for the monthly goals. We are right there. So close. Couple of subs and bits away from filling up this bar today. Smart fella is going to start it off with one gifted sub. If we all gifted one tier one sub right now, we'd fill up this bar and some. Let's make it happen, y'all. So how do I get my horse? She said uh, you have, have to go. Now. Well, there's. she said you you have the horse now, so bring up your items. Bring up your big inventory. Oh, my big inventory. Yeah, the big inventory. Oh, I do. I have to, I have to assign. And so somewhere. there, you see that ring right there? Mm, yeah. That's the horse. Oh, okay. How do I? And you can, if you go to your equipment instead of inventory, go up to equipment. Uh, you can put it on the quick swap oh, bar down below. Okay. Yeah. Okay. This uh -huh. one. Yeah, exactly. And then you can just like boop beep up and bring oh. them up whenever you want. Co-op, you're not allowed to use the horse at all. So a lot of just running around in this uh. game. I've actually only rode my horse maybe twice. This entire time that I've done. Wow, that. people love the horse, Mikey. Uh, you out. know what? I don't fuck the horse. <laughs> okay, you know what I mean? I'm, a, I'm the one that's willing to say it. Fuck the horse, y'all. Jesus, I don't need Christ, no goddamn Mike. horse. I'm, I travel on foot. I'm a vagabond. Uh, shout out to Boss Jacobs for the gifted tier one sub. Soft, uh, Soft X with the gifted tier one sub. Last class gaming with the gifted sub. Now we're getting that bar filled up. Let's keep it pushing right now. You all are killing it. Thank you so much. For the support, thank you for helping fill up that bar right now. No, see, there I'm... wasn't one on that wall right there behind you. Interesting. I'm sorry, like over here. Yeah, like right up on this wall. There's nothing. There was none that was that was near there. I hear something. I don't see okay. anything though. Keep your eyes open. I thought there might be one. I'm trying to remember the first three that are in this area that are easy that we could grab. I think there's something up here, though. Yeah, see, here's the deal, Twitch chat. I loved D-Horse. And then y'all started talking smack on D-Horse and was like, yo, you got to grab Quiet. And I was like, Quiet sucks, y'all. And then I never went back to either one of them. Who'd you stick with then? Uh, D-Dog and just a little bit of just me solo dolo. I didn't need nobody. You mm -hmm. know what I mean? I'm a lone soldier. That's what Snake taught us, Bear, you and I. We don't need help. What the fuck is up? Oh, shit. Oh, that, that guy seems to have seen you. <laughs> oh, we can fight this guy. <laughs> oh, fuck. Come here. Fucking fight me, bitch. Calvin oh, Coffey shit. To give the tier one sub. Thank you, Calvin Coffee as well. 
drink the juicy juice. No, finish him. Finish him! Vanquishing enemy groups. Vanquishing an enemy group will replenish your flash. The number of flash types uh, to be your advantage. Ooh, okay. look at that. So that's the open world concept that I'm talking about where you might be out and traveling, exploring, all of a sudden you're running low on your flask, but you don't want to go back to a site of grace. Bada boom, bada bang, you kill an enemy. Oh, what the like fuck that. is that thing it all the way up, up there? Look I'm, at him. What? You mean that rainbow, right? No, the fucking big monster <laughs> is fucking uh, walking around all naked like. All right, so what's going on with this uh, electricity here? Do I need to be scared? I mean, I don't, maybe get struck by it, you know what I mean? Wait, oh, well, that thing just died. Okay. <laughs> okay, maybe I don't want to go. Get on your horse. Get ooh, on your horse ooh. and go see that cool yeah, jet yeah. stream. And go do something crazy with it. Show the people. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, we're on PS5, y'all, just so you know. We're on PS5. Nate yeah, plays let's go. Tier one stuff for 11 months. Holy Thank you, Nate. Shit. Welcome to Storm Hill. Ooh, the weather's setting in. I don't I don't know if I want to be up here. You never know, bro. You never know until you try. That's I know. for sure. You never That's know fair. Until you try. That's fair. Never gonna Where am I at on the map here? Dude, this is fun. This is cool. Yeah, it's super dope, bro. The open world is really fun in this game. They've done a great job with it. Alright, bye horse. By horse, I battle now. You can battle on your horse as well, just so you know. Oh. You can like ride by, swipe him, ride by, swipe again. You know what I mean? Do some okay. crazy stuff Let's like try that. Let's Come at me, bro! <laughs> <laughs> there you go, bro. You did seven damage to him. Holy shit. Yeah, I, I, oh God, he's running towards me. <laughs> Jump off the side. Believe in yourself. Okay, you might die. You might die. Okay, no! you <laughs> That was a little too high. It was too high on the high thing. You know what I mean? Fall, fall damage. Too high. Too high. Holy shit. <laughs> Whoops. That's all right. Yeah, that's all right. I mean, we, we didn't, didn't do too nothing. much since, uh, yeah, we, uh. No, you already leveled up. You didn't yeah. have any souls with you. Nothing special. All right, well, then. Hmm. Where are we at on time? Uh, we're about to wrap up here. We didn't oh, fill up the we're bar, so up. we're okay. yeah, we're three minutes out. Well, three minutes out, Bear. What do you want to tell everybody before the weekend, then, since we're gonna start to wrap up here? I, Elden Ring seems pretty cool. That's all I'm gonna say. I'm sorry we didn't spend as much time with God of War this time around, but we'll get back to it eventually. Um, I think maybe next week might be a little busy. Uh, but we'll try to get back to God of War as soon as we can, because I, I am having fun with it, um, you know, uh, and now we gotta go find Pandora's box, I love the, you know, little sprinkling, uh, as Andy likes to call it, sprinkling in the sex, right, we're getting a little oh, sprinkling wow, okay. in of, like, uh, you know, Greek mythology that we probably were, um, taught about in school, so I, I, I like, uh, little things like that, so that's, it's something to look forward to whenever the next time we, uh, mm -hmm. we stream mm -hmm. God of War. Mm -hmm. I like that, Bear, you know, we have a fun week. Ahead, we'll do the morning show on Monday. Mike and Andy play Elden Ring co-op. Wednesday will actually be our 300th stream here at Kind of Funny. So me and Greg, or maybe me and Barrett, depending on Greg's schedule, will do something fun and awesome with that one. Then Thursday, Mike and Blessing, we will finish, I promise. We will finish the game that I don't care about. I promise we'll finish Metal Gear Rising, and then we'll play some other games. Friday, we got a dope stream you don't want to miss out on. Sifu race y'all i'm getting all of the best all the best kind of funny members together we're gonna race through sifu who really's got it we'll find out but that will wrap up our kind of funny game stream today we'll see you all back here on monday goodbye everyone